Guys, this is an important historic moment for me in speedrunning. I'm finally learning a new game. I know. I've been playing Spiral 1 my entire life, and after nine years of speedrunning just that game, I finally decided to pick up Spyro 2. The last two, three weeks, I've been doing nothing but periodically and lazily procrastinating practice of this game, and over the last couple days, I finally was able to go through the whole route of no early Ripto 100%, which I will explain in a minute once we get into this. Um, and I think I'm ready for my first true speedrun with an actual route. <sighs> So without further ado, let's get into it. Three, two, one, go. Oh my God, I'm excited. So a couple of warnings I wanna give is I'm on kind of a shitty PS2 and disc combo right now. I'm playing on standard disc speed in hopes that my game doesn't crash. If my game does crash, I do have the memory card here, so we'll be able to load. Also, I'm playing on my shitty laptop over here, which has been known to blue screen um, while streaming. And oh, I need to hold start there. I'm already losing time. <laughs> And of course, I need to just try my best not to be in too much of a hurry here. I just want to, uh, does it, can you buffer the start input here? No, I don't think so. You have to like just mash. I'm obviously still quite a noob to this game. I have a long way to go. So a big focus I want to have for this run is to just keep a good attitude. Keep the spirits high. There are going to be points where I get lost. Points where I get stuck. Um, possibly for like a really long time. Especially with stuff like gulp skip, stuff like um, theater, getting to Dragon Shores early. Go this way. But I have been practicing and I'm confident that I will be able to get through the entire route of this game. And my estimate is going to be around four hours. That's my estimate. If I do any faster than that, then I'll be extremely proud of myself. Oh, what the fuck? You're supposed to hit that guy. Here, I'll just talk to Twitchy and then shoot him. Okay, and another thing I always mess up is you have to like kind of stand next to Twitchy to make his shit work. You gotta like run up to him like that. Okay. These lamp posts are a bitch. You know, Glimmer actually, this is one of the harder levels in my opinion for 100%. Hitting these lamp posts takes like some serious precision. These first few are not that bad, but as we get into it a little bit more, I mean, hopefully I can get them all in a reasonable time frame here because they are on a, on a on a timer so these first few are not that bad but the next room of lamppost is going to be a fucking nightmare uh okay fuck you're supposed to go over him no okay i got him Shit. and then also the other thing is i'm trying to get used to d-pad controls which you can see my movement is extremely wonky right now it's gonna take me like, pff, I'm not even kidding you, like months to get good at using the D-pad in this game. Um, shoot this. I'm probably already like running. Yeah, I'm already running out of time on the lampposts, I think. I'll come back for that. Here, I'm just gonna get the lampposts for now because they're about to run out. Oh my God, please. See, look, I already missed, I'm already running out here. Okay, quickly, quickly. There we go. Good recovery there, good recovery. I need to go back and grab the grab the gems. <sighs> World record pace, yes, exactly. So yeah, this could be the beginning, as Fredman says, this could be the beginning of a new era for me in speedrunning. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna like stick with this game, to be completely honest with you. So Fucking dude, oh. you're, you are not supposed to talk to these guys. Ugh, hold on, I'm trying to... God <laughs> fucking shut the fuck up, I know! Don't get mad. The only happy thoughts. He's like, how about, I know you already unintentionally talked to me once. How about a second time? Okay. Now this is the tough room. If you thought that last area was annoying, we'll get ready for this bullshit. Let me clean up some of these gems first. Kill this guy. And then hopefully get all these lamps in one go. First of all, hitting this one is a fucking bitch. Nice. Almost. Okay. No. 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 Okay. I'm just gonna go super speed mode right now and just try to get all the lamps. I'm probably already gonna fucking miss some. Okay, come on, quickly. Get the fuck out of the way! Yes. No! 
Dude, are you serious? That bonk cost me. Oh, I gotta do the whole thing again. Yeah, are you serious? Circuit fried. Thank you for the sub. You see how tight this shit is? Can you believe that? Can you believe me that that fucking Twitchy the gem cutter got in the fucking way? And one thing I always like to point out here is the actual 100% route in this game would clean up this entire room while getting all of the uh, lamp posts. Just to give perspective on how good 100% players are at this game. But I am just going for just the lamp posts right now and then cleaning up after. I think for now I can do this though. Nice. Okay, quickly. Get the fuck out the way. No! No! Please! No! Oh. Come on, dude. How am I gonna get this close every time? How am I... Whatever, I'm cleaning up this area. How am I gonna get this close every time? Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Well, anyways, like I said, I need to contain myself. I need to not get angry here. That's that's a very important thing. As you can tell, this is extremely, like, just an extremely frustrating experience, but at least for now, I'm having fun with my with my own trashness. But yeah, I'm, I'm basically like a child in this game. I, it, it, I know some of you guys might be thinking, especially on the YouTube comments, like, hey, um... You know, you're good at Spyro 1, so does any of that translate to Spyro 2? No, it does not. Zero translation. Oh! Lost in translation, even. <sighs> this is such a hard fucking lamp to hit. There we go. Okay. We gotta get it this time. I, I fully believe that we can get it this time. Perfect. First try. Are the controls more fluid? No, they're not. Um, well, not for me, because I'm used to Spyro 1. You're asking the wrong guy. If you want to ask about like, oh, is this game better or is it different? Just type exclamation point difference in the chat, because I'm not going to get into like a whole thing right now about like the differences between these games. I'm sorry. Fine. Look, you know what? You know what? I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll, I'll entertain you guys. I may have answered this question thousands and I'm not shitting you, thousands of times over my course of streaming on Twitch. What are the differences between Spyro and 1 and 2 and 3? Think about, I've been streaming for nine years. Think about how many times I've answered that question. Just think about how many times I've been asked that question. I'm gonna just, because this is going on YouTube, I'm gonna entertain this, but just, I want you to consider that I fucking am tired of this question and I literally made an entire video to, to answer it, which you can see on my clips channel linked below. Um, I gotta go down here. You're, you guys are also, by the way, you're also distracting me from, I'm certainly gonna miss a gem here if I haven't already. But I will entertain you guys with the differences between Spiral 1, 2, and 3. I'm so, by the way, I'm sorry if that sounds like annoying, like, or just explain it. But like, just try to see it from my perspective for two seconds. Anyways, let me go ahead and, and, um, and entertain it. Um, in Spiral 1, the controls are a lot more snappy, right? So like, you, he like stops and turns like, just really quickly is what it feels like. Everything in this game for me feels sluggish. That's just how it feels to me, okay? Keep in mind, I'm speaking as a Spiral 1 connoisseur and a non-Spiral 2, 3 player. The controls in this game are just a lot more sluggish and floaty, for lack of a better term. Um, there's a mechanic in this game that doesn't exist in any of the other Spiral games. Do I have all the... Okay, I need to grab the talisman and then I'm good. So I didn't miss anything, luckily. There's a mechanic that exists in this game that does not exist in any other Spiral game called... Uh-oh. I'm just gonna go around. I went the wrong way there. Um, called double jumping, all right? Which is this mechanic right here where you you can like do that little extra bit of jumping in the air by preserving upward momentum while charging in midair. It's called a double jump, all right? That doesn't exist in Spiral 1, nor does it exist in Spiral 3. Um, so this whole speed run is like built around the double jump. Um, it, the whole movement, if Spiral 1 is like really like fast paced, like, you know, gem to gem movement, uh, you could think of it as like horizontally based movement. This game is a lot more vertical with its movement. You have to like kind of traverse up big ledges, like all over the place and go out of bounds. And that's kind of how the routing is built uh, in this game. Not to mention just, you know, I'm sure all the casual players realize this. This game has mini games in it, which have, have all of their own sort of like strats and 
you know you got to learn all those as well which don't those don't exist in spiral one the boss fights with their own rng gulp crush all of that so it's a whole different approach um as a speed run as a game to like sort of master so to speak as a casual experience they may not seem that different but once you start like speed running you realize that these, you know, Spyro 2 and Spyro 1 are just leagues, leagues apart in terms of the approach and uh, what you're really trying to optimize. Like, think about these stairs, for example. See how I'm, like, having to double jump? In Spyro 1, you would literally jump and then charge like that to get up the stairs. So just every form of just basic grounded movement is completely different between the two games. Um, there is nothing that carries over between one game or another except for one mechanic um, called... Oop, I gotta go grab these. Except for one mechanic called flame charging, where I will display here on these boxes, if you flame and then charge into a chest, the gem will home in automatically, when ordinarily, it would just do this. It would just pop up into the air. So that's the only technique that, literally that is the only technique that has carried over from Spiral 1 that I have like you know, mastered or whatever. But even that is like a lot different in this game than it is in that one. You can flame charge from a lot further away uh, where am I going? I gotta go... I gotta go back to Hunter. I think. Yeah. I think I was supposed to grab some gems, like, back this way. But yeah, yeah, grab, like, these. That's what, that's what it is. Yeah. So, again, a lot of this, um... That, that's, like, my just quick explanation about the differences. Um, again, I made, like, a little video kind of summarizing a lot of that information. Um... That you can see on my Clips channel down below, or if you type exclamation point difference in the chat. But at this point... Uh, it's important that I stay focused here. I need to talk to Hunter. It's important that I stay focused here and that you see I kind of got like a little lost right there. That's going to be happening a lot throughout this run. Again, I've like hardly scratched the surface enough to like even learn a basic route. And for those who have never speed ran before, in order to learn a new game, you have to learn a route through the game. That is, you have to learn a specific set of directions to go at any given moment. You know, I'm like, I gotta do this hunter minigame, then I gotta go, I know I gotta go to the orb that's over there, you know, and then swim in air to the fucking speedway, so that's like the route. So that's the big difference between this and my uh, casual 100% playthrough. It's not necessarily that I'm like any better at the game, but it's just that I've learned a route, which is big. That's like a hard thing to do for a like, for an hour and a half, or whatever, this is gonna be like four fucking hour long, like, playthrough of a game, you know? Hopefully it's less than four hours. Hopefully it's more like, um, oh, I gotta grab these. Hopefully it's more like, uh, three-ish hours. But, you know, actually good speedruns of this would be sub two hours. Get that out of bounds right there. Grab these. Okay, you don't need anything else there. Boom, boom. And now we go to the speedway. Another thing. I would like to mention is that this is not what modern 100% speedruns do. I am doing a completely different route than what you'll see in uh, from other high-level 100% players. This is called No Early Ripto, as you can tell by my splits down there, No ER. Which basically means that, um, uh, it basically means I'm gonna end this speedrun on the Ripto fight, essentially. Uh, whereas modern 100% routes would not do that, interestingly. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about, like, the implications of that as we get towards Rip- Oh! Whatever, I'll come back for him. Where am I going? No! Hit him! Okay. Flip it around. No! What?! It's supposed to go through the- It's fine. Just retry it. It's fine. It's fine. Just trying to get too fancy there. That was- that was on me for trying to get too fancy. A lot of these speedway routes are uh, particularly funky. Live! Okay. See, it's like you want to hit that guy before he like gets- Oh! Before he gets going. It's fine. I'm just going to leave those two guys. I'll just come back for them at the end. It's not a big deal. I got to remember that my goal here is not necessarily to like, oh, fucking perfect this shit. It's just to get through it, which I am very frustrated with. Right? Trying to get through it. But we're keeping the attitude strong right now. Despite fucking everything up, I am still... The goal is to stay on route. <laughs> it's not to be good, it's to be on the route. Which I generally am. As long as I am generally following the route of this 
a speed run. I am happy. Now I gotta get the last few cart guys. I think there's... Let me just chase this one down. I think the other one's gonna be right behind. Come on, pussy. Nice. Beautiful. Tight sphincter? Yeah, definitely tight sphincter. Uh, retry. I also didn't split at all for Glimmer. I'll worry about that in a minute. Let's talk to Queen Minnie or whatever the fuck her name is. I guess not. Okay, let's skip split. Yeah. I am not going for out of order rings. Not yet. I will eventually, but not now. Oh god. Another thing um, I need to personally work on is not getting upset with my chat room. You know, I want you guys to understand that my ego is just completely in shambles as I play this. So any, even the most innocuous of questions or like commentaries on my gameplay, I, I have the tendency to take way too overly personally. Like, like for example, are you going for the out of order rings route? It's like, no, I suck, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like, it's that type of thing. So, you know, I'm gonna try my best to like, have some damn fucking humility and not be a bit, to not overthink everyone's fucking chats for two seconds. That is one thing I know I kind of have trouble with. I mean, more, more, um, more important than anything is to like just not like get like in a bad mood, whether it's from some innocuous question or from like getting stuck on a level or whatever it may be. But yeah, I'm not going for the out of order rings here, nor am I going for the out of order um, uh, like money guys in the other speedway, the other like hunter mini game thing. Great job. I'm it just in general with the mini games. Um, I'm not trying to be like, I'm not trying to do like the optimal thing right now in most mini games. I pressed retry. I meant to press quit. Give up. We got everything. We're out. Um, quit. Split. Sixteen thirty-three. Beautiful. Uh, what's next? I don't even know. We'll find out. Um, yeah, I gotta go. I gotta grab this shit. Anything over here? I think there's like some gems right here. Yeah, yeah. Grab that. And then go this way. Okay. Now we go up on top of this. Ugh. Okay, and then we fly to the crush fight. Hello. Sorry about last night. Hey, it's okay. Before you All right, let's roll. Uh, fine with you, Shane. Oh, my bitch, man. All right, let's roll. I have to really try my ass off to not to not get emotionally invested in you guys here. I'm gonna be a I'm gonna be a good stream. I'm gonna be a happy streamer today. I'm not gonna let you guys get me down. You guys will, will not, you guys do not have that kind of power. Yeah, that camera was like fucking stressing me out. Why no inputs? I just don't have it plugged in. I, I, I'm streaming on a different computer right now and there's just not enough uh, USB ports on it. Okay, so we would be taking damage abuses here. Um, but I think if he does yellow again, I think I will not. Yeah, I'm just gonna like just dodge the yellow shots here just so I don't lose sparks. Cause I'm scared of dying literally. Oh, see what I'm saying? Like I could have died there if I took a damage to do. take a damage abuse on the yellow ones just because it's uh, faster but something tells me uh, it doesn't matter if I save like a second or two 
on like little shit like that. You relate to Crush? <laughs> I will say I'm like, I'm definitely like, um, I don't know if stressed is, I guess for lack of a better word, I'm like, there's like a lot o overwhelmed. Maybe I'm a little overwhelmed at like everything happening. I'm like trying to, I'm stressing a little bit. Not that I'm not having fun, but I am stressing a little bit trying to keep up with everything right now. Just trying to like, okay, go here, now go here. Then it's like, okay, now, we'll, oh, press the split button, you know? Just like little stuff like that, you know? It's just none of that stuff is ingrained into me whatsoever with this game. Whereas with Spiral 1, it literally just comes like without me thinking. Even just looking over at the, remembering to look over at the chat and stuff like that. Oh my God, please. Oh. Okay, so this spot, if I can get through this whole area in like a relatively short amount of time, I'll be extremely proud of myself, though this could take like a long, long time. Like even just getting this like little jump right here could take fucking forever. I think I remember my issue is that I need to be facing a little bit more towards the wall. So let me do that. Oh my God. The other thing about this is you have to do a walking double jump, which is not the easiest thing. Okay. Oh God, that kills me. Let's try again. There's no rush. That's the thing is right now I feel rushed there, when in reality, like I'm gonna take as long as I'm gonna take, you know. I would love to get through this area quickly, but that probably won't happen and that's okay. That's like the mindset. I gotta expect that that's like what's gonna happen. Oh my God. Get up there. Uh, Big Garth, thank you for the gift. There we go. There we go. Fuck! I'm literally, you know what's funny about this is I'm literally not even at the hard part yet. The hard part is coming up called gulp skip. You can see on the splits here. And I'm sure many of you guys are familiar with this. This is like one of the like really hard parts of the run right now. Okay. Oh, okay. Just get up there, baby. You can do it. Okay. Oh. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I'm like so ner I'm like exponentially more nervous um, now that there's like a time now that I know that it's like it's a run you know it's it just totally changes my whole mindset with everything it shouldn't but it just does because I'm a fucking noob with this shit oh and grab all this don't forget to get zapped by Zoe go up here alrighty we still gotta get gulp skip. Now this is, I'm not even at the heart, like I said, I'm not even at the hard part here yet. I'm tapping down strategically to, you know, get it right. Oh, I almost missed it. That's why we be careful there. Okay, we got zapped. Now, hopefully I can at least get gulp skip like before I run out of lives. That would be, that's like my goal right now. That might not happen. Now, if I get gulp skip on this try, I'm gonna lose my mind. That would be fucking God tier shit. Though I'm not expecting, like I said, not expecting that. I have to get stuck inside the wall, essentially. There is a breakable wall on the other side of me that we are currently looking through with the camera right now. And we're trying to get stuck inside of that right now. And to do that, I have to tap left ever slightly so that it pushes Spyro forward like the minimal amount of units possible. Like not even... Once he starts perching, then that's how I'll know we're close. There we go, we're close.
This process takes a while. Okay, I'm in the wall. I want to be slightly perpendicular. No, that's not going to work. I'm going to get pushed out, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm going to probably get pushed. I'm just going to keep doing this. Yeah, <laughs> I got like snapped out. That almost worked, honestly. That like almost worked. I'm going to take a death abuse and do that again. I'm not really sure what went wrong there. I mean, there's probably some sort of diagnosis for like why. I've never actually gotten stuck in the wall like that before. Um, I'm pretty sure there's some diagnosis for that, though I do not know the exact. I, I think it might be that I charge glided too early or maybe did too high of a jump, perhaps. But it was, I think that was a signal that I was, uh, I did have a good angle. Normally I'm too parallel with the, with the camera angle on the wall, and I don't think that was the case there. And again, for all the casual viewers watching right now, I know this looks like I'm cheating. So feel free to let me know in the comments if you think this is, if you want me to play the game. No, honestly, if you want me to play the game without doing this, I have a playthrough like that on my YouTube that you can like watch. So please don't, I don't want to hear like any like, yeah, this time do it without glitches. Shut the fuck up. This isn't even a glitch. Oh, what the fuck? Like literally this isn't a glitch. You don't even know what a glitch is. That's how fucking dumb you are. Like, I don't mean to be mean, but like to the YouTube commenter out there that's thinking that, that's what I have to say to you on that topic. Anyways. Too long of a charge before the glide. Okay, thanks, Dom. Thank you for the diagnosis. I'm not saying this is intended. I'm saying it's not a glitch. If you guys want to get into like a big thing about how to define a glitch, I mean, go ahead, but I'm trying to focus on this trick right now. A better word to use is exploit. And I think there is an important distinction there. Uh, okay, I'm in the wall. Uh, that might be too parallel. That, uh, like, I'm gonna do it here. Yes, second try. Dude, that's not bad. That is not bad at all. I will. I'm taking that shit. Fucking split, baby. That is first first run, second try gulp skip. Go money. That is money right there. That is not bad at all. Now I don't want to die on gulp, so but I have to remember to end gulp with no sparks because of the route that I'm doing. Again, I'm doing um, a version of the run that. I'll explain once we get there. That was really good. Second try gulp skip. I will fucking take that. Fucking hit him. Hit him. Okay, that's fine. So on the last damage or so, I'll be I'll be careful to go sparksless. Now, an optimal gulp fight would involve um, hoping for good RNG from the birds to get- Oh! It's okay. To give you um, eggs that like allow you to do double or triple hits. I might just grab this for now. I know that seems weird, but I have a feeling I might take more damage here. So. Just gonna play it safe for now. I'm gonna do my- Oh! Okay. I have to remember- Oh, okay, this is good. I can get a double here. Come on, eat it. Dude. Oh, no, he blew it. Fucking bitch. I should have waited for him to finish that before trying to... I gotta remember my strat with this. Yeah, you gotta kind of... You gotta get him like that. Now, I do think it's possible to do that. Oh, I don't know. Some shit like that. Is it... Hey, uh, Dom, is it bomb, then barrel, or is it barrel, then bomb for the double hit there? Ugh. Come on. No. Okay, I'm already out of sparks. I'm, I'm grabbing one more. Don't you dare. Is he gonna hit him? That's not even gonna hit him. I'm, I'm grabbing another spark. Literally, I'm just like so bad at this fight. I'm grabbing extra sparks just so I don't die. But again, I need to remember to go sparks. What's at the end? Is that gonna hit? No, it's not. Barely not gonna hit. Hold well, on, let me see what Dom said. I'm pausing. I wanna read what he said. Bomb always first. Okay. Let me see if I can do this. Fuck. That's fine. Bomb. No, he's eating it, you dumb fuck. Jesus. Okay. 
I'm just going for this. Fuck it. If that's a rocket, I'm gonna be mad. Fuck! <laughs> I should have waited. It's okay. At least we're at least we're doing damage on him and not dead. That's really the best I could hope for right now. Yeah. I'd like to maintain this sparks value for now. Playing this safe with these shots, and I'm normal you could just fucking hit him right now, but I don't want to take damage yet. I'm gonna wait till I'm on the last bit of health, and then I'll go Sparksless. What do we got? Um, oh my god! Okay, that's fine. Just go for this. Don't die! Don't die! It's fine. Hit him. Okay. And we just want to kill him at this point. Oh, okay. Come on. Clean that. Come on, baby. Give me that. Yes! All right, beautiful. Beautiful. Hit the fucking split. Oh my gosh, dude. My fucking heart was like actually racing there on that. When I almost died. Holy fuck. We actually killed Gulp, and with no sparks, that's... that For some of you guys, maybe that's like not that impressive, but for me, that's actually a really good. So, let's go. I think I finally come up with a way... <sighs> EJ, hit the split. <laughs> they're all gold splits because they're all my first split, so every split is technically my best split, which is what gold means. Okay, don't grab the penguin. So, what I'm about to do now is go to Dragon Shores early. So, I have to get into winter, like, the, get into the castle area first by doing this. And while I'm at it, oh, grab some of this shit. Or maybe I could have grabbed those metal boxes, but whatever. Now we go out of bounds. I believe the modern 100% route at this point would, um, would, I think, actually, yeah, also go into Dragon Shores, but then, uh, hold on, let me focus. Uh-oh, hold on, I might be fucked here. Okay, that's fine, try again, try again. As long as I don't die here, I'm happy. I'm, I might, though. It's, it's, <laughs> I'll, I'll be happy even if I do, I'll be unsurprised if I die here. I need to focus. This is definitely a focus moment, because I have to go into the Dragon Shores portal from underneath, because the portal isn't activated yet. So that's why I'm doing all this out of bounds shit. Oh, that's not gonna make. I'm telling you right now, that's not gonna make it. So I'm just gonna fly back in. I got a little bit. I dropped a little too much. You really need to preserve your height there. I've fucked up that trick enough to know that that was not gonna make it. I mean, maybe it could have. I don't know, but. For my own safety, I'm op I'm opting to not die. Again, if I die here, like, I have to go into Robotica Farms and then go back to Sparksless again. Which is not ideal. No, oh, you know what, I'll, I'll save those metal chests for later. No biggie. That's not making it. Cool. No rush. Guys, there is no rush here. This could take as many tries as it needs. Okay. And crank it around. This can make it. Nice. Okay, we're in Dragon Shores. This is good. And now the hard part. I need to get out of bounds in Dragon Shores with a precise walking double jump. Then I need to swim over to the fireball portal. Then I need to swim over to the theater cutscene, which will unlock all power-ups. Well, I almost did that shit first try. This is actually a really tough out of bounds here. This is gonna take many tries probably. Ugh, oh, close though. I need to maybe hold Cardinal left a little bit more than left up. Trench Dog, thank you for the sub. A little too low. A little 
too low. I think I'm uh, turning in a little early there. Oh, that was a close one. That almost got over. No. Oh my god, come on. Oh, dude, get over it, you fucking bitch. Oh, why no sparks? I need no sparks because if I try to swim by going on, like if I go underwater with sparks, the game will crash. So you need to be no sparks for, for what I'm doing. You can tread water with sparks, but you can't go underwater. In only in this level. Because they never, I guess because they never, exp oh, nice. Oh, I got on the portal too. That was the first time I ever did that or on the wall. Okay. So yeah, if I had sparks right now and then pressed square, the game would crash. So that's why I'm sparksless. I don't know why that is, but it is what it is. Yeah. Nice, so there's the fireball. And now... Yes, we got the fucking theater. I love it. First try, I love that. Now we just select the last cutscene of the game, and then this gives us every other power up in the game. <sighs> now, a big reason why people don't run this particular route here where you go to the theater to get the power ups, a big reason why that's not done anymore is because actually fighting Ripto early, which gets you the same cutscene, also unlocks one extra hidden power up that I don't get in this run, which is an extended gem range for Sparks. And that alone makes the run, like, way faster. So now we can exit level. I think now I would split, probably. And uh, let's go to Robotica. Now the run can start proper, and I'm actually extremely proud of myself to have gotten through all of that in sub-40 minutes. That's really good for me. For my skill level. And we're going Robotica. You seen Blumpos do a different jump technique? You mean to get to the theater, perhaps, you're talking about? You can, there's multiple ways to get to that theater cutscene. I do the, I do the one that Ali Dest does in her, uh, her ancient world record of 139. Oh, I did not, I did not have to get that. Let me focus. I'm basically doing the Ali's route from, uh, 2017, essentially. Why? Because that's kind of like my, in my mind, like what the OG fuck the OG version of this game, or the OG speed run is of this game. It's like very much like a, kind of a, a trip down memory lane for me to kind of play the game, to do it this way. But as I get more um, comfortable with this category, and maybe once I get like sub two with no early Ripto, then I'll, I'll consider um, just doing the normal 100% route where you kill Ripto early and switching, just, you know, adjusting my route accordingly. It shouldn't be too much of like a, you know. But for now, this is just what I want to do. Oh. I will fully acknowledge that this is just objectively slower than doing the, what would you call the modern 100% route of this game. Oh, But that's fine. Because I'm gonna be slow either way. Oh my god! Pumpkin. pumpkin. Yes, I am sparksless right now. I would like a sparks. Or at the very least, I would like to not die. Ooh, watch out. Okay. Oh, I missed the gem there. I missed all of those guys. That's fine. I'm just going to snipe them. Get this out sniper mode activate. Should kill all of them. Nice. My fields are, My fields are safe. Seven minutes across five years. Well, for comparison's sake, um... Okay, let me just not take, let me just not die here. <laughs> let me get the other guy too, hold on. Where is he? I know there's another guy here somewhere. Dude, I am fuck, I would love a Sparks right about now. That would be great. But no, uh, you're definitely right, Dom. I think there's a lot of like merit to learning this route. I mean, considering how different it is and I think it's like, I don't know, historically relevant. And in the, there's like a whole conversation to be said about like the history of this category. Like, you know, for a long time, it was, like, kind of argued that, like, you know, you should end the game on the final boss, which this run does, and the modern route does not. 
So, you know, there's like a, there's like a whole like history to, to this whole speed run, you know? And I think this route like helps, helps kind of in a way sort of preserve that history. I know as a, I know no one really cares, but as a, as a speed running nerd, as a Spyro speed running nerd, I think, I think it's respectable to, to learn this. Okay, now let's fucking shoot this bitch. And talk to this. Nice. New nine, thank you for the good luck. But yeah, seven minutes across five years. Um, five years ago, the world record in 120 was like only like maybe a minute and a half faster. So yeah, that's definitely true. I mean, I don't know. Different games, right? So. I have more enemies than I need at this point. I definitely went out of my way for extra enemies just because I don't want to sit there and wait for the fucking... I've, I've been kind of under en enemy-ing lately, so I just wanted to kind of over-enemy there. Which is fine. Oop, that's fine. How difficult is the first half of the run compared to the second half? Oh, real quick, I just want to say, like, if the music cuts out, that's, like, basically my disc slash PS2 being annoying. Um, I am playing on, like, the PS2 that has the best music, or, like, the most the well, most well-preserved music. Um, so, yeah. I'm gonna grab that red. Uh, head over this way. Hit that. Oh, I missed it. Grab that, too. I don't know if I was supposed to grab that right away or not, but that's fine. Okay, I missed those, which is- you know what I'm gonna actually do? I'm gonna actually just grab those now. Because it'll be annoying later if I hadn't have broken those boxes, so. Believe me, it would be just as much of a time loss later, anyways. I go this way. Okay, I fucked up pretty bad there. Let's re just redo that whole thing. Dude! Oh my god, I am not turning quick enough there. I have like, this is, I've never had that problem before, but now I am. I need to turn like right during those green gems. I don't want to be like a moment too late with them. Uh, like that. And then these greens as well. Turn early. Okay, that's all of them. Nice. Go this way. Grab this. Oh, I could have kept the supercharge going for just a second longer, but that's fine. We would end it there anyways. And uh, let me grab, oh, I, I should like kind of go for that like right as I'm heading towards it. I think I missed it, that's fine. Over this way. Can I get the gold? Okay, I got it. Go for this, fuck it. No, hold on, <laughs> I'm just gonna aim it. Fuck it, swag. Is that gonna hit? Oh my God. I gotta hit that last pumpkin. Teleports me back up here, and now I can uh, do the last of the supercharging and finish the level. Where am I going? Oh god, I should have jumped a little harder there. My B, but alas. Give me the double. Oh, yeah. oh that wasn't even a double flame charge. Come on. Okay, Robotica Farms complete. Beautiful, we didn't miss a single gem there. So I wanna just kinda discuss my expectations with missing gems here. I expect to like miss gems in a lot of these levels. I'll be happy if I go like half and half. Like half levels I complete without missing a gem, half, you know, I don't. That's like my goal, is to be half and half on missed gems. Or, you know, forced gem recovery at the end of the route. So I have been tr having trouble with that in my, uh, in my practice. Okay, go up here. But I think it's good that I'm laying out my expectations now, so that way I don't, like... That way I can, like, acknowledge when I'm being a bitch later and, like, not be angry. But, you know, it's like... I think it's... For me, I'm highly, like, just self-critical. This is, like, some issues I've been dealing with in my practice. It's a real, like, um... I need to try not to be so self-critical, you know? Like, that's the idea. Just just have fun. Like, don't even worry about, like, how good you're doing or, like... Just have fun. I But I will say I'm doing good so far, so... Let's pray. Now, also, let's not pray for... Let's pray for no game crash. Good. My game crashed there last time on on standard disk speed, so I'm happy that did not happen this time. Okay. 
Maybe I was supposed to hit the other guy there. That's fine. I remember the flap mechanic exists. This flapping mechanic does not exist in Spiral 1. Where's the other guy? Oh, there he is. Yeah, there's still one more hiding somewhere. I gotta keep my eye out. Did he just pass? I think I, I thought I heard his car there. Just kill all these birds and then track them down. There he is. There he is. Found you, bitch. Nice. Not bad. I will say that is like the easiest like speedway route in the game, so. Sub one minute, well fuck it, I'll take it. Okay. Now we head over this way. Talk to Hunter. Come on, Hunter. Alright. Alright. Uh, dude, if I can get this first try, I'll be super stoked. This is definitely one of those that's like, it's not hard, but it's easy to fuck up. So gotta be careful. I mean, but again, like, one, once again, if I if I fuck up the whole thing, it's like, no big deal, let's do it again. Come on. Yeah. Use the analog stick for this, I feel like I'm more precise with that. Nice. Okay, good. Those last two are the hardest hey, ones. You... Good. Oh, I don't split yet. I, I still don't know where to split, so I have to like remind myself when to split. Also, I have to remind myself to press start on the orb cutscenes like that. Oh, I pressed retry. Quit. Quit. Split. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. We are moving through this. Pew, pew, pew. Yeah, you have to like pre-aim the shit. Exactly. Oops. I gotta head bash this. We are going to Autumn Plains. So far, so good. Hey, what's up, Sonia? Great to see you. Yeah, basically the Canyon Speedway minigame is like Counter-Strike, essentially. What's up, monkey? Welcome, welcome. Hey, happy birthdays uh, to monkey in the chat, right? It's your birthday today? I saw that on Snapchat. Happy birthday, monkey. Everyone say happy birthday, monkey. I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> that work? Come on. Uh, I gotta, come on. I gotta go down like this. I kind of went a little bit in the wrong way there, but that's fine. Get these two. Yeah, I was supposed to just go down straight to this way. Whatever. I gotta remember to flame charge. I gotta remember you can flame charge underwater. That's like a thing. No, no, oh, come on, dude. <laughs> fucking get the fuck out of here. Shut up. All right. <laughs> I almost had it. Wow. Yeah, get me out of here. This 
Idol. It's idle. Oh. That first fish comes pretty quick. This is, a, interestingly, at a high level, this is actually one of the most high, like, RNG sections of the run, is this little fish mini game. You can literally, like, lose, like, I don't even know how much time, like, 30 plus seconds here. If you get, like, <laughs> if you get bad fish RNG, that was just bad execution on my part. You do have to wait with the fish. You can't flame them right away. You have to, like, be a little late with them. What? Okay, that was just bullshit. There we go. All right, let's roll. I don't know if that was like good RNG or not. I don't know. <laughs> I'll take it. I was supposed to collect all those gems right away, but it's fine. We gotta kill some of these enemies, I think. Hello? Can I get everything there? Mistake that bug for a blue gem. To aim the camera. Shut up. You're supposed to dodge Zoe. That's why I'm like jumping there. You're supposed to dodge Zoe. It's like actually a surprisingly big part of speedrunning this game is dodging Zoe. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab these early. I don't trust myself to get them like after the mini game before the cutscene starts. Uh, let's see if I remember this shit. I'm a legend. Like that little, see that, that little second before the thing ended? Nice you, you would grab the two metal chests then. Imagine that. Okay, press start. Don't forget. Okay, now we do this. Oh, but, oh, if I had first tried that, I would have lost my mind. Oh, oh, come on, I'm so close. There we go. Uh-oh, okay, we're good. Almost like semi fluid movement there. Oh, dude, I hate bonking on that. That's like surprisingly common there. Also, I'm just gonna grab this. I don't know how to grab that at the end. You're supposed to like grab that at a point. Yeah, you're supposed to like get up there somehow and like grab the chest right at the end. I don't know how to do that. Good job, Hula Girls. Where are the fans of the Hula Girls? I fucking love the Hula Girls. These are like some of the best NPCs in the game. I can see why Blunt Bows loves them so much. Okay, now I'm gonna try this once. I'm, I think I'm gonna fail it though. Yeah, you're supposed to like jump off that rock like optimally, but whatever, I'm just gonna climb up the stairs. Like a damn chump. Hula girls and fawn girls, where are the fans at, dude? How much time does the proxy jump? Uh, I'm just gonna, I don't mean to be like pedantic here, but the word proxy... Uh, are you talking about in the, um... On the treasure chest? 
You're talking about the treasure chest. That is a proxy. Actually. I was going to say that's not a proxy. That is a proxy. Yay, we got everything. Nice. Let's roll. Idle Springs done. So nice. We're two for two of levels that, you know, to get all the gems. We got them all first try. That's very nice. Um, how much time does the jump from the treasure chest save? I don't know because it's baked into the route. So probably a lot. I mean, to go around naturally to grab those gems and do a whole route that reflects that probably loses, I don't know, like 20 seconds or so. I would guess like 20 seconds. Am I going the right way? I'm not going the right way. Where do I go here? Oh, I got to go this way. I always fuck it up. I got to go this way to Colossus and then but go underwater first and to think there for a moment. We figured it out. You know? Thank you for the good luck, Ioni. Love you. Thanks for the nice message last night. Doing good, Dale? Thank you, Doug Bit. You're doing good too. Sexy bitch. Hula and Fong Girl emotes. When I get sub two in this game, I'll give my I'll allow myself to have Spyro 2 emotes. I don't think I've earned them yet. <laughs> Anytime I see like a casual streamer that has like Spyro emotes, I'm always like, you didn't earn those. <laughs> you don't speed. <laughs> I'm looking at you, sandwich. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's fine. Do oh, okay, we're good. Wait, you're supposed to do this. Hold on. Oh, I think a walking DJ is the move here. Yeah. Hello, professor. Oh, thank good. Why are we doing 100%? Uh, what, was I trying to get 120 in Spyro 1? Yeah, but here's the thing. I've been running Spyro 1 for nine years, and I already have an amazing PB in that game. Uh, so please don't pressure me to do that anymore. Thank you. I'm... I, this is just... I just want to... I mean, I don't know. Do I need a better answer than I just want to? <laughs> like... A question like that kind of, like, puts the pressure on, you know? It's like, hey, wait a minute. Like, shouldn't you be doing X? Like, no, I shouldn't be doing anything. Like, you see what I'm saying? I had to fight my, like, a lot of, like, harsh emotions inside myself to, like, stop myself from, like, you know, bashing my head against the 120 wall here. I'm gonna keep playing 120. I'm not, like, quitting it or anything. So I, I hope that's, like, an okay enough answer to why I'm not, like, currently grinding the shit out of 120 right now. I'm, like... This might be a crazy thought, but I'm realizing there's more to speedrunning Spyro and streaming and making YouTube videos than just... Uh, than just getting a 120. And you know, if anything, I was feeling quite stagnant, you know, to even just going for like this 120, like... Spyro. Even if I got it, it's like, you know, I mean, I just... I don't know, I just feel stagnant. I want to grow, like, internally and externally, like... There's like a lot of reasons for me to learn a new game like that. And a lot of reasons to like not be so stuck on Spiral One. I think this is like the healthiest move for like my growth as a human being, if that makes sense. Oh. Dougbit, thank you for the uh, sub. I'm calling you sexy. I'll call you sexy again. Keep talking like that. So I do need to learn the manipulation here. You can you can manipulate the guy to hit the puck directly into you. I don't know exactly how to do that. I believe Blunt or someone has a uh, tutorial for how to do that. I'll have to study that another time. Maybe I can get it here. No. You have to like make him turn towards you a bit more. That's what I'm noticing. Yeah, I'm gonna do the 117% run sometime in the next few days. Um, that is, I haven't forgotten about that. I do have the game, I will do it. Keep in mind, I am currently at 770 subs. So if we can get up to 800 subs, how's this for a deal? If we can get up to 800 subs, I'll do the 117% run tomorrow. Hmm? How's that for a deal? I'll give you that deal. If not, I'll do it in the next few days at some point. But if we can get up to 800 by the end of the stream today, 
If you guys want to see me play Spiral 117% blind for the first time, I've never won 17% of that game. So it'll be like a total casual, total casual speed run. So if you want to see that, we're only 30 subs away. We're technically only um, 16 sub points away, but 30 like natural subs away. Feel free to drop a gift if you want to see that. Would you like to try a game of one -on -one? Track, thank you for the prime. I see we have a 117 fan here. But to be fair, we did hit, um, we did go over 800 for just like a minute um, at the end of uh, my 1500 or 1200% race. So I will do it either way, eventually. But if you want to see it tomorrow, that's good. That's good. Oh my God. Yeah, active subs. Well, I say natural subs because, uh, yeah, active subs is technically the right word, but I say natural subs because, like, I think that's a more, I think that word makes more sense. Whatever, who cares? Uh, fuck, he's about to, this man about to score a goal. Kill this bitch. I'm gonna be really quickly just acknowledge that I'm gonna lose a lot of time on mini games here in this, in this run. Like, that should be probably the main thing I start to focus on for future runs is, you know, learning the strats for hockey, learning the strats for the Huracost thing, and whatever other minigame I have trouble with. Get it towards me, fuck. Well, this is very classic, like, first run hockey type business. Oh, no. Fuck! Come on! Stuck ass puck, come on. What? Where is it? Did he take it? You know. Hey, excuse me. Up away. Fucking bitch. My god, this guy's challenging. Ego chow. Please? Okay, barely. Yeah, like, thank you for that gift. I love you. You're the best. Oh! I swear I'm gonna learn to re I'm gonna learn to pronounce your game your name again at some point. Oh you cute little bitch. Thank you. Thanks for the bits, guys. Uh, one second. Oh god. Am I alive? Okay. No, no, I lost it. This is lit. You're lit. Oh, uh, come on. There you go. Love it. Supreme Court, thank you for the prime. <laughs> thank you, Supreme Court. I never thought I'd say thank you, Supreme Court, ever, but here we are. Right. There we go. That's missing. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, to, even for a casual player, I'm like taking long here. It's fine, just need this last point. I like kind of, there we go. Wide open. Well <sighs> Balls. The goal horn be like. <laughs> I bet you guys can hear that through my mic too. Okay, okay, this way. Stay focused. Hips and thighs, no lie. Stay focused. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I'm gonna speed run here. Thank you. Uh oh. Ugh. Okay, uh, how do I get back up there? Uh, recovery time? I'll do this. I think you can jump on this thing. Yeah. Low. Shut! Oh my god, I wasn't even near you! Dude, I should have had that. I should have repressed square. I keep forgetting to do that. So that way I don't flop. See, I keep missing the square, but whatever, we're good. <laughs> I, I have to, as a result of that, I need to activate this now. Not a big deal, though. Practice that proxy a bit. It's a cool proxy, though. Cool that proxy. Come on. Are we re-entering the era of long ass cheers like 77 trillion 777 billion 777 I was about to be like, what are you talking about? Then I was like, in my mind, I was like, oh. 777. 
guy went flying. No, you have to, dude, that is like the most surprised Zoe of them all. She just comes out of nowhere. You have to be ready for her. I might have missed a gem back there. In fact, I'm just gonna look real quick. Over here. Should have flame charged that. Okay, I think I, that was all the gems. We should get the fucking, uh, we should get the, I'm gonna listen to the horn right here for you, Ignis. Let's go. I'm out. Not bad. I mean, not good, but not bad either. Just hold square the whole time? I mean, the, does the proxy, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna trust your thoughts on that. Why yeah, why I I found it to be more consistent to get the proxy if you let go of square, but I'm gonna <laughs> who cares what I think? I'm just gonna listen to you. Why I I thank you, Big Garth and Ignis. Uh, did I get all those gems? I wasn't looking. You guys see me get all the greens there. Day of day, a happy day of day, a happy day of balls. Why am I usually shirtless? Just think about wh what I'm doing right now. I'm sitting in front of three different screens. One of them is like an old school CRT TV uh, and stream lights as well. So I just have a bunch of heat sources around me. And you're asking me why I'm shirtless. It's fucking hot, dude. Think about like what a streamer surrounds themselves with for like hours at a time. Just think about it. How, how would you like, wouldn't you want to be like shirtless too? It's, I feel bad for women on this website. They, do, they should be able to be shirtless, too. Why do you think most streamers wear, like, um... Wear fucking... What's it called? Tank tops and shit. Bridgeman, thank you for the tier 3. Super generous. The white chuggers in the chat. You'll love to see it. 80 watts is a lot of heat in Cali. Well, I'll have you know I'm in Missouri, and also you're a fucking bitch. Oh, aren't you like a fucking electronics expert? Oh, so you know the exact amount of heat that 80 watts generates, right, you fucking nerd? Jesus Christ, man. You wanna make fun of me? I'll fucking lay into you if that's what you want. Fucking cocksucker. I'm calling you a nerd, meanwhile I'm like fucking just playing this game all day. I guess I have no right to talk on that front. Oh, I should have saved those boxes. Oh, I got squished, that's fine. Not everyone needs a webcam. Look, are you guys trying to get me to put on a shirt or no? Just say what you're oh. say what you're trying to say here. Byro, Anonymous, thank you for the far. gift. Love you, appreciate that. You guys are fucking pissing me. This is what I was saying earlier today. Like, I gotta not let you guys piss me off like this. You guys are you guys are getting you guys shut the fuck up. Okay, I'm gonna- Oh, Okay, I'm just going for these now! Oh! Wow, I almost recovered that. God damn it! That's fine. I'm just going back up. Your lead shirtless stay alone. Damn bra. Yeah, I know. Like, what? I can't not wear a shirt on this website. I'm- Look, I'm sorry. Society has, like, a fucking double standard about this shit. That's not my fault. Alright. Thanks for shutting- Barry Foxes, thank you for the uh, 100 bits. Don't act like you guys aren't completely fucking naked in your chairs right now. I'm just trying to enjoy- God forbid I try to damn enjoy the game for two seconds. Okay, that was dumb, but whatever. At least I got the two gems. Let's see if I can get this. Oh, nice. We're good. Okay, now I gotta go down here. Oh, like this. Oh. Perfect. Get the talisman. Thank you, Spyro. Zep, yeah, thank you for the prime. You Love you. <laughs> Everyone Everyone strip JK. What do you mean JK? I'm removing the JK from that. You guys all have to get naked right now. What the fuck are you guys doing? 
That's like a command, honestly. I don't usually ask a lot of my chat, but you do guys you guys have to get naked. That is one thing I like insist. And if that makes you uncomfortable, then uh you know. Fuck! De deck of Fragum. <laughs> Thank you for the for the sub. Deck of frame, I think that's pretty. Dude, I am just getting fucking demolished by everyone here. Yeah, let's roll. Dude, he, they're so hard to hit. For being fucking giant dudes, they are like impossible to hit. I'm telling you, to play this game, you need to be a pro sniper. It's fucking ridiculous. Like the fireball, it seems like it covers a lot of ground, but it really does not. It's like a very... You know what I'm saying? Like, holy shit. We so hard to hit anything with it. Shit. What? Yo, Godly, thank you for the gift, and Big Garth. Yeah, Twitch won't do shit. They especially won't give me a 70-30 sub cut, that's for sure. If they're feeling quirky, they might ban me for no fucking reason. But, God forbid they fucking give me a reasonable paycheck. Dude! Ah! Why can't I hit any of those guys? That is it's so infuriating. I'm gonna lose my mind. I just gotta st I just gotta avoid them entirely. Do I have any sparks at all right now? Give me this one. I've gotten hit, I think, by all of those guys in this level. Like that was just impressive how many guys I got hit by there. Okay, we did get all the gems, which is good. See if I remember the, the general route here. Gotta grab just two here, actually. And then grab this. Oh, shut up. Damn, what was that noise you made? Grab this. Oh, actually, I didn't need that. I'm just gonna leave that there. Oh, wait, no, maybe I did need that. Yeah, I did need that. I'm already fucking this up. Come on. Sniping that hoe too. I don't think I needed to snipe that guy, you just get him on the way back. Get everything here. Come on. More of them back here. Dude, are you fucking joking? Come on. Just gonna clear out the last of them now. At this point, like, they should have already all been dead. Like, I'm doing, like, way more laps than is, like, required here. But whatever. Oh, he's getting away. No, I got him. Yeah, okay, chill. Clean it up. I don't really know the details of like how to make this section go correctly, but maybe I'll review it more in the future. Hopefully there's like a video tutorial for this area as well, that would be nice. Uh, I, I did follow the general route that Ali did, but maybe I'll watch more runs and see like what people do. Why is the siren going on? I already killed them all. I think there's a few more over here. Okay, we're good. They are balls. Thank you for the 300 bits, Liv. Really appreciate you guys uh, donating, and thank you, Anonymous. Okay, we're out. And so far, we have hit it. We've done every level, um, getting all the gems like without missing any. So for that, I'm really proud. 
even if these mini games are taking like fucking five, ten minutes longer than they should. Bridge man, thank you for the five gifts, you fucking legend. You generous son of a bitch. Hope you're feeling well today. I love you, man. Never forget that. I love you for more than your generosity. I love you for your bridge. <laughs> and by bridge, I mean cock. Love you, man. Mm. Oh, what are we at? We're like, oh, we're almost at, um, we're almost at 800 sub points. We're not quite there yet. I don't know if my OBS has caught up yet. Someone type exclamation point subs in the chat. It'll tell you the natural subs if you do that, which is going to be like probably around 782 or three or something. Oh, no. Yeah, I'll just grab these early. 782, yeah. Like I said, if we can get up to, um... If we can get up to 800 by the end of this run, I will play Spyro 3 117% blind in one sitting tomorrow. Which will take roughly 16, four, 10 to 16 hours. It will be a super marathon stream, so if you want to see that, if you want to see me go through the maximum pain possible, um, feel free to drop a gift. And thanks for watching. Not blindfolded, blind. You know, there used to be a time where people understood what a blind playthrough was. Blind just means you're doing it without a, a speedrun route. That's all that means. So just casual. In other words, casual. But not really casual, because I have to beat the game in one sitting, so I don't know how casual you'd call that. Whatever. That's what the word blind is used to describe. Blindfolded is what you guys are talking about. I'm just saying blind. Twitch actually removed the term blind from the tags because they thought it was like oppressive to blind people, which is just hilarious. It's like a bunch of actual blind people like would chime in and be like, uh, we don't care. Twitch is like, no, yes you do. <laughs> It's like, I can't hit any of the big enemies. Big enemies. <laughs> Fucking turtle! Gotta make sure to jump into the deep part of the water there. Speaking of turtles. I gotta remember not to fireball that guy too early. Thank you, young dragon. That turtle working for the man. <laughs> All right, enough blind jokes. Shut the fuck up. Well, they can't see the tag. What do they care? Shut the fuck up. How funny. All right. Hello, young one. Blind plus blindfolded? That would be like the ultimate fucking stupid shit. Make a blind person wear a blindfold during a speedrun. Right. Yeah, you just- so I gotta remember, you just wanna fucking charge into them. That's the key, because the fireball is just too wacky. So. Okay, I think- yeah, there we go. Come out this way. I'm going. No. Uh oh, is that gonna go? Nice. 
Legit. Off the wall, I know, right? Crazy physics game there. Yeah, I know, it really does. That's like such an underdeveloped mini game there. You don't even have to talk to the guy twice to start it. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta break the box through the thing, which I'm failing at. Hello? Come on. Dude, come on, you can do this. How am I missing this fucking box? Hello? Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. Maybe you gotta do this. Dude, hello? Am I stoned? Hey, can someone give me a tip here? I'm just giving up, dude. I'll, I'll look at this another time. You're supposed to break the box through the wall. <laughs> Whatever. Impressive. It's fine. Did I get all the I feel like maybe I missed a gem here. I don't remember seeing the 400 out of four. Oh yeah, no, we got it. We're good. We're out. Chilling. <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to shoot through the wall there and break the box. At least that shows like what I was doing, which is kind of cool. Yeah, you can. Hello, Kunji. And then if that's the last box, it'll teleport you back to the guy like that. So it's kind of cool, cool way to end the level. Okay, I already went that way. Yeah, Aquarius Towers, let's go. What's up, Herc? Welcome. Big Herc in the chat. Get your cheeks busted. Mm -hmm. I'm doing good, man. I'm moving very promptly through this run. I'm actually very proud of myself so far. But we'll see once we get further into this how, how much worse I do. You fucking got me, that fucking bitch. Oh my god, dude. He just won't stop destroying me. Right. Gotta get into the corner here. Here's another wall shot here. Can I get it? Re reposition. There we go. Nice little sequence break to the ending area here. Uh, wait, we go up this way. I suspect if there's going to be any level I miss a gem in, it'll probably be this one. I'm going to just real quick just review this area. Okay, yeah, we're good. <laughs> I'm like, I don't trust that. I missed a gem there uh, in practice yesterday. So didn't understand my apprehension. Oh, he almost got me. Spooky. Jump scare. That made me jump, dude. Oh. Where am I? I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> oh! No, no, you're gonna do it again! <laughs> I'm gonna cry, dude. I'm having, like, childhood nightmare flashbacks right now. <laughs> Just kill them, man. I don't like these guys. <laughs> Alright. It was Subtilius. Thank you for the sub. Love you, man. 29 months, dude. What a long time. One of my longest subs. What a legend. Where am I? Okay, I gotta go here. Grab the reds. Grab the green. Gem. 
Come on, just get the fuck up there. Okay, don't, I almost fireballed there. You don't want to do that. If you press that button, you basically fuck yourself. I'm getting everything there. I'm, not, I'm taking some wonky, wonky lines, but I'll take that. Nice. Our world is oh, man, those shark. That shark fucking scared the shit out of me. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Hey, thank you, Kunji. That's very nice. You wanna go to sleep? Have a good night, Leet Speaker. And what's up, Skeletal? Great to see you, man. Hope the run's been shut. Dude, this run has been going actually very swimmingly, no pun intended. Um, it's going even better now that you're here. Love you, Skeletal. Skelly. You did it! It is really 100%, because there's an in-game, like, 100% counter. If there was not an in-game 100% counter, then then your point would have more merit. See what I'm saying? Oh wait, I gotta go this way. And the 100% counter does not include skill points, so there you go. Therefore, the speedrun does not. I am Tony AMA. Thank you for the sub, and thank you for the good luck as well. I really appreciate the support. Love you, Tony. Yeah, if there was like a skill point counter that counted towards the 100% uh, statistic, then... Maybe it's... Well done. I don't know. What the, there is like a like a miscellaneous category for all skill points. I think I don't know what the world record is for that. You guys can look it up on speedrun.com though. Now that the man uh, try harder. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I had to think about that. I gotta grab the blue. I might fucking fail this quickly. Oh, that was my bad. That was my I wasn't ready for that. I should really just grab all those greens like from the get-go. That would be like the wise move. That was my B. My B. But yeah, you are supposed to grab them there, but you have to like be really ready for them. Kind of an awkward like movement section. Yeah, you can just grab that one there actually. But I think about it. Now this part's gonna be a little spooky. I might fail this. Nice. Come on. Yes. Beautiful. Incredible. You've got Miss Red? Alright, we'll see. I might. I, I have to do some extra cleanup in this area. If you mean in this area, then I am going to clean that up right now. Yeah, normally you would be done with this area now. Grab these. I guess you would collect those during the thing, but I gotta use my sparks finder at this point. Yeah, I gotta go out of bounds now. So yeah, this is the first level where I've like actually legitimately missed gems. All skill points is 29-22, nice. Seahorses are hermaphrodites, let's go. Try harder, I'm trying. Okay, let's see where that gem is. Oh, there's one, I think. No, that's a sheep. You guys see any gems anywhere? I think the Sparks Finder might get broken out of bounds. It might be part of the issue. Oh, there's one. Oh, I forgot about that one. All right, there we go. Yeah, I just full on, that makes sense that I missed that. I full on forgot about that gem. All right, we're good. Not the fastest Aquaria in the world, but hey, I'll take it. We're out of there.
Doom, 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 doom. This is more entertaining to watch than an optimal route. I wish everyone felt the same way you did. <laughs> uh, did I get everything there? I'm just making sure I got everything. Yeah, I'm good. Cool. This should be um, Summer Forest 100%. Yeah, nice. Oh, don't go Winter... I almost went Winter Tundra. Autumn Plains. Let's roll. Very nice. And then the next split is for Skelos. Nice, we're, we're doing good. Tell chat they don't understand how hot it is. I mean, I'm happy to reiterate that. Like, in, for your typical stream setup, you're gonna have like a bright ass light. If you use a webcam, you're gonna have a bright ass light for your webcam. You're gonna have at least, oh, I'm going the wrong way. You're gonna have at least two screens. You know, one for your game, one for your computer. But in my case, I usually use more than that even. Um, and one of my screens is a giant fucking CRT TV. So that's even hotter. Um, so, you know, if you stream, it's in your best interest to be in a highly air conditioned room. Uh, I do have air conditioning as well as a fan pointed at me, but even with all of that, um, I need to have a, uh, well, I don't need, but it's, it feels better to have my shirt off. It just gets hot sitting in front of all these like electronics and lights for so long. And I, you know, to be fair, I'm one of those people that prefers like the cold. If you're one of those people that's like more like into the hot, into the heat, then it's not a big deal, I don't think. But. That's just how I am. I miss it. Come on, buddy. Yeah, I mean, not on top of that, I'm like, you know, trying to like execute. People, I mean, this may sound like kind of silly. I could see where people would make fun of this, but it is physically exerting to try to speed run a game like this, you know, like a platformer. A lot of like inputs and like, you know, energy, the physical energy that goes into that. That definitely makes you sweat. On top of like nerves and adrenaline and stuff. Uh oh, I'm low on sparks. No, okay, I almost died there. That little wizard boy. Hopefully I can get this in just one go here. Go for that guy. If not, I'm gonna have to do some serious recoveries. We're good. I just don't die here. That's all I gotta do. Go. Uh oh, hold on. I'm dead. Fuck. That was just bad movement by me. I was trying to go too... I don't know what I was trying to do, but... At this point, I have to go recover the, uh... The question mark thingy over there. So let's snipe that. Go back up here. Uh-oh. Okay, that's fine. Hit this fucking guy. Come on, dude. You fucking bitch. Jesus Christ. Pretty optimal. I have to grab that red on my way back there. No. Oh, okay. You actually don't want to eat the thing. Okay. Uh-oh. Come on, recover this. Uh-oh. This is going to be extra hard now. I don't know if I'm going to live this. I think this has to be possible with green sparks. I missed it! I think you, like, need blue sparks there straight up. I'm, I'm not sure if green sparks is, like, a possibility at that spot. Also, I have to go recover the question mark boxes again. So this is like really bad, but whatever. Dude, what the- Dude, what the- Oh my goodness! That was like the worst time to get the cutscene. I should have glided instead of just jumping. Okay, and now I'm actually gonna go for two sparkses. It's funny, because I did have blue sparks going into that area, but... Huge 
huge uh, blunders by me here, unsurprisingly, for a first run. But whatever. It's fine. It'd be, just, it'd be like so much easier if you could just death abuse, but no, you can't death abuse. You have to like, get all the fucking question marks. Alright, so I'm gonna shoot this guy, for starters. Go up here. Glide over to this thing. Fly back, using two damages. Break that shit. Oh, and I'm dead! I'm... I didn't even know that! Try again. You have to charge the lizard and the bone auto collects? Okay. Uh, let me try that, um, I guess, somewhere. I guess I can't try that anymore. <sighs> How many times have I done this so far? <laughs> Jeez. We're going particularly badly here. So you're saying don't, you're saying don't uh, fireball the lizard up here is what you're saying. Just charge him from the, uh, from the platform. Okay, don't get shot. Hello. Still got shot. You bitch. I don't have to get that question mark thing right away. Here, I'll test it on this guy. So you just charge him and then the bone auto collects. No, it doesn't. You have to like charge him a certain way, you're saying, like in the nuts or whatever. Interesting. So I'm gonna have to practice that guy at some point. What pace am I on for this run? I'm hoping for like a sub four hour run. That's what I'm hoping for. If I get anywhere around three hours or sub that, I'm, I'll be blown away. Also, I should have sh uh, flamed that guy from underneath, but whatever. Thank you, Spyro. Now I can put my friend back together. Yeah, watch Alley there. Yeah, I'll have to refer back to the Alley video here. But not right now. Not for this run. I know, I know. Finally. Oh, that took uh, many tries. I think some of the gems fall on the ground, right? Yeah. Dude, oh my god, why is it so hard to get up there? Just fucking whatever. What? Oh, I, th I thought he was going around the other way. I'm a dumb fuck. I've not learned this game completely. This may come as a surprise to some of you guys, but I do not understand everything about this game yet. Okay, he's coming around. He's just going straight this way. I thought he was going back around the hut. I'm sure a lot of you guys were like, why are you waiting? Grab this guy. Well done, Grant. Let's see if I can be ready for the guy. Because, like, that going around the back of the hut... Man, never mind, dude. You don't... You guys don't fucking care. Look, I'm gonna try to get the fucking uh, guy around the back this time. If I can first try this, I'll be blown away. I'll be stoked. Where are they? Uh-oh. I'm supposed to go that way first, I think. I'm already fucked here. I'm already fucked. It's over. Good night. Goodbye. I'm so fucked here. Oh? Yeah, that guy's gonna eat him. Yeah. Around the back, around the back of the hut! So it's not that one, it's over here. And get this guy. Come on. Now get the other guy before he gets him. And then get this guy. Oh, he's good. Okay. okay. Thank you for helping. First try, both times. I'm a legend. Okay, let's not get frustrated. That was kind of frustrating. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That was kind of frustrating, but there's no reason to be mad because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. So I don't know. What to do. Uh, 400. I need to grab the talisman. I forgot to grab the talisman when I came back this way. Let's go do that. I'm glad I caught myself on that before leaving the level. Luckily, the talisman's right here. Did anyone tell me? No. Hey, thanks for not backseating me on the talisman there. 
I know some of the speedrunners here watching probably wanted to. Not to read you guys' messages too closely. Well done. Okay. Go up here. Go to Metro. Oh. All up in the club, Metro boom and see these guys with evil eyes, what they up to. Oh, there she go. that fucking guy hello dude how do you hit him don't hit the water hold on come on buddy you can do it oh dude why is he so good why is he so good that guy is impossible oh my jesus that was like the worst recovery in the history should have just flew out further Chill. Glide. Oh, wow. The recovery on that glide. Oh, that was fucked there. I should have flamed the bird first. That's fine. I'll just do another lap. To the right? Yeah. Now we're done, I think. Yeah. Beauty. That was more like the Wait, I'm uh, I'm not done? Come on, there's one more fucking gate that I missed. Oh, it's over here. Where, when was I supposed to get that one? Uh, I don't know. I think I fucked up. I think I was maybe supposed to flame the bird and go to the right. I don't know. Okay, go up here. Been having a yeah so this is another as people were mentioning in um in the other speedway this is one of those levels uh where you can actually not follow hunter and just like do like a different a different route um but it only saves like a couple seconds and it's definitely harder i will learn it eventually but for this first you know few runs i'm not gonna worry about it. just follow the auto scroller like a dumb fuck It's interesting that such routes are even possible where you like go, I think around here you would like go off uh, You'd go off route from hunter around here It's crazy that that's even possible because if you get too far away from him according to the game then you'll like fail them the mini games. And then furthermore that doing a A route like that even makes an auto scroll section like that even faster is like extra interesting I think Not like what I did I did it like the casual way you watch a real run of this. You watch someone who actually knows what they're fucking doing. Okay, exit. I keep forgetting to press uh, quit. On the last thing here, but we are out of there. Metro, done. 143. Hopefully we can get out of uh, Autumn Plains uh, in a reasonable time. Hopefully Zephyr doesn't take too long. We have Zephyr coming up next. How far into the game percent-wise am I? Uh, I don't know, maybe like 50? 50, 50 or 60 percent? Something like that. So 
this is one of those levels I was kind of having trouble with uh, in my speedrun practice. There is a couple of really tight jumps you kind of have to do here, so... Not to mention cowlicks are kind of a bitch. Forgot about that guy existing. Yeah, you don't need those greens yet, so you can just go for that. By go for that, I mean fucking hit it. Ugh. I'll grab that later. One more green right here. Oh, Jesus Christ, I was not expecting that. Grab the extra life, why not? I definitely needed that. Enemies do not drop gems in this game, correct? They do in Spiral 1, but not this game. Okay, this is the tough jump I was talking about. Nice! First try, I love that. I was having a lot of trouble with that jump before. I'm just taking it slow here. So I don't fucking die. <laughs> I don't. Played it safe. Played it extra safe here with my movement. I don't, I don't think we need to talk to the professor here, do we? Uh, yeah, we do. <laughs> I guess I need <laughs> Good thing I did that. Okay, let me try to do the actual cool strat here. Okay. And then when I get the gem, I'll probably, like, fall down, I think. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> I love that that's, like, a strat. He's falling off. Fuck. He like disappeared. Shit, I just <laughs> that, co that cost me some time there. Yeah, I'm just gonna shoot him up there for now, and then grab the other one. Please make it. Oh yeah, nice. And Kobe Bryant, that shit. Rest in peace. Fucking guys up there. And just let them walk up naturally. Don't get, in a, don't get in a hurry. There are like, that's kind of like an inconvenient spot for them to be in. I, will this work? Okay. They have to be like right on the edge for you to hit them. Right. Now you can just blast them. The kingdom fuck. What? Where'd they go? Oh, there they are. I thought I, thought I lost them or something. What the fuck? Hey, hey. Come on. Oh my fucking god, hello. Ugh. When I was like learning these cowlicks casually, I was I was quite impressed by the consistency of their movement. But now that I'm trying to go fast, I, I can see why they're so frustrating. It's like when you're trying to go fast, they tend to like, you know, going quickly like is not necessarily good for their AI, you could say. But they are, at least they are consistent in their AI, which is a good thing. Fuckers, oh, they are going the wrong way. <laughs> None of them are going in. Come on, buddy, you can do it. That's crazy, it like made the noise, but I don't think that other one got all the way in. Yeah, you want to charge them here, basically. I don't 
don't really want to use the fireball too much. Thanks, Pyro. Thanks, Pyro. Oh, we got some cute chatters here. Uh, Skeletal, Dragon, and Ioni, and Claire Crow. Love to see these names. You guys are dope. Can I just, like, do that? That works right here. Well, I should try, like, gliding there at that spot, and then I'll end up in this area. There, I forgot. Okay, make him kind of walk towards the pen a little bit. Oh, come on. Off the fucking other cowlick. What? You fucker. No, oh, come on. I can do this. Oh my good golly gosh! Hello! Fucking Jesus. <laughs> yeah, the fucking- the defense, Steph Curry in the fucking- <laughs> in the cowlick pen. <laughs> Doing big things. Oh, I just ran off. I didn't think I was gonna turn that hard. Bro, oh my goodness, pro level speedrun. By the way, I have a world record in a Spyro speedrun. Just, just to add a little bow on that. Just to give insight into how much it doesn't fucking have any relevance to this game. Like some of this dumbest shit. Oh! Oop, you know. Everything there. Uh, yeah, this one. Dude, Jesus. These enemies got balls. I'll give them that. Fucking jeez, man. These enemies are going nuts. Hey, this should be the end. I have a feeling I've missed a gem somewhere. There is it. Hopefully it's close. What? Oh, gee. Come on, man. What? Well, I don't have any sparks anymore. No sparks finder for me. I said it was right here. Oh, wait. Maybe there's like a balloon thing? Huh? Any backseaters? Yeah, it's this guy. I knew there was a gem back. I had a feeling about that. Okay. I had a feeling about that particular area right there. Okay, we're out of Zephyr. That wasn't too painful. That really wasn't too painful. Compared to how bad practice went in that level yesterday, that was not too bad. Hangman, what up? Alright, uh, down here. Well, Berserk, I have not memorized all the gem positions in this game. I have memorized a route, okay? And those are two different things. To, to memorize a route, this took me like maybe like, I don't know, like two solid like sessions of like really two or three solid like long sessions of- Why am I- Okay, you do not want to activate those guys. That was stupid. Um, come on, shut up. Let me, let me do this real quick. Okay, barely. 
but to memorize where every gem is in a game, because I in Spiral 1, I have every, like, gem position memorized, basically. Um, that takes, I would say, like, several months of speedrunning, like, a, a given 100% category of a Spiral game. To, like, know exactly where every single gem is and be like, oh, that's weird, there should be an extra gem there, say, if you, like, do a section sloppy, you know? Th that's a different thing than memorizing a route, okay? I just want to be clear about that. Uh, I'm gonna just try this jump for funsies. I don't think I'm gonna get it. But... Yo, Lucid, thank you for the sub. Welcome. Yeah, talk to him. Love you, Lucid. It's great to see you as always. first and then the snowball. Hello, did I charge this guy? I wonder. No. You're not supposed to wait for that yellow. I don't know. Oh. oh yeah. Oh, what's up, Gecko? My day's going very well. This run's going like overall better than I expected, so I'm really happy about that. I do need to kill a few more enemies actually, so let me kind of snipe some of these guys. I got plenty now. Oh, I gotta wait, there we go. Quickly. Oh my god, hello. Please hit him. I am gonna turn around for those gems though. I probably should have just kept grabbing those gems and then finished off after, but whatever. Yeah, that's kind of like an awkward little detour like this. I was hoping I could like kill them like more efficiently than that, <laughs> but alas. Learning experience. Fucking dude, how do you do that? I'm so bad at it. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Oh my god. Good hit. Okay, so I gotta make sure I kind of bear to the left here for George. Old Georgie. Until he gets up here and then keeps going, I think. Oh, I think I was supposed to grab that gold gem right there. That was my bad.
Maybe not. Maybe I can grab it on my way back. We'll see. Die, George. I'm just gonna get him to follow me, I think. Yeah. Oh wait, but you can't you can't go too far away from him, otherwise he'll get confused. Grab that gold and then finish this off. You found yours. Now I did not see the 400 out of 400 there, leading me to believe I missed a gem somewhere. Uh, we are missing a blue somewhere. Uh, I have no idea where this gem could be. It's not around here. I don't know if I... Oh, wait, Sparks Finder. Yeah, I use the Sparks Finder. I forgot. I always forget that's a thing. It's down over this way. It looks like maybe it's like downstairs here. Unless it's in the beginning area. You, <laughs> bro. What? Okay, hold on. Wait, I'll die if I go that way. Ugh. I, I don't think it's down here, actually. I think maybe it's in the beginning area. Or maybe it's not. Maybe it is down there, actually. Hold on. Look at this. Strat. Ooh, yep. Look at that strat. I'm a genius for that strat. Crazy recovery by me there. I'm out. It's a top 100 time. 230 is like a good like um, goal, I, I would say, for me. to. For now, my goal is like sub 3. Not on this run, but um, just in general, around a 2.30 is like my goal beginner time in this game. But this is my first run, so I plan to do like worse than that. I plan on just somewhere between three and four hours on this run. I'm gonna have to pee. That's what I get for drinking like four cups of coffee today. I decided to start running two. Did I get burnt out or want the trophy holder? Um, I don't want to get too deep about it. I just think I would grow as a human, as a speedrunner, and as a creator by playing this game. And I'm going to leave it at that. There's no, I don't want to go get into any like, oh, I'm burnt out on Spiral 1, but guys, should I keep playing it? You know, it's like, it was obviously kind of a tough decision for me to like put down my intense, monstrous grind of Spiral 1. So let me just like, you know, enjoy this without thinking about it too hard, you know? That's like what I'm asking here. I do think this would be like, this is good for, for me. Even if I don't have fun with it, you know, there are some very frustrating moments in this learning, I gotta be honest, but I think I'm making a lot of progress. The soul mechanic? What the fuck's a soul mechanic? Wow, that was just amazing. That was just amazing execution by me there. Legendary speed one. This is like such a weird area to clean up. Wow, that missed. Bro, oh my Jesus fucking Christ. Hello? What if I like aim like down this way? Okay, whatever. Jesus Lord. Imagine just being able to hit these fucks. Wow, it hit the Oh my god, that's infuriating. I didn't even know that could happen. I needed to proxy off that guy. So I have to run all the way back this way. I mean I could have tried proxying off that guy too. That was insanity stupid fucking Zoe right there. But now I know that's a thing. I didn't even know that was a thing before. This is one of the only like required proxies of the run. 
which is part of the reason why I learned this route instead of like any other ones. But it's, um, while it is one of the more consistent, like easy quote unquote proxies, it's definitely precise. So, you know, like every proxy. I, oh, oh man, the flop, I don't know how that flop even happened. That was annoying. I pressed X in midair, but the game was not having it. Ugh, this could take a while. You love ads, hey, all right. Will I submit this time to speedrun.com, I think you're asking? Uh, maybe. Shit! I should really consider just submitting all of my actuals. Oh, nice. Beautiful. I should consider um, sending all of my, like, actual speedrun speedruns that I've done to speedrun.com, including CTR, specifically CTR and, um... And, uh, what else? And Katamari Damachi. I should, like, go grab- Cause those, those videos are on YouTube. I can just dig them up real quick. So if I do submit this game, I'm gonna submit those others too. And I'm honestly, at this point, I'm thinking of just doing that. I was- I was being, like, Mr. Tryhard, Spiral 1 only fucking ass dude, but... Not anymore. Not anymore, I've turned a new leaf to where I'm okay with sucking at other games and letting that be known to the world. What? Oh, that guy exists too, man. I should, I should probably kill that guy at the start, I'd reckon, unless he respawns. I don't have a command that links to those runs. PS1, sorry. But literally just look up, go on YouTube and look up Dayo Man Crash Team Racing and you'll probably find it. Thanks, Spyro. The spiky guys scare you, yeah. There's some scary enemies in this game for sure. Yo, 420 chef, thank you for the sub, man. One whole year. Yo, congrats on the one year. The golden badge, looking like a baller in the damn chat right now. Thank you for that, man. I love you. <laughs> I was hoping to like proxy up onto that one. Should be good on gems there. You can like proxy off that box by charging into it. Alright, readjust my glasses there. That was great nice. work. Great work. Great work, Spyro. Love it. Trouble with the trolley, eh? Nice! That was actually not a bad- oh. Besides taking forever on the proxy, which is like totally unsurprising, besides that, that was a really good Breeze Harbor. Yeah, zero trouble with the trolley on that one. We're gonna get races with Hypno Shark? Maybe once I get better at this category, yeah. If I get better at this category and learn Spyro 3, I'll consider racing Hypno in 337, but he does have a huge leg up on me, for sure. I would race him just for the memes though, like squad stream with him. But I'm really not even remotely close to how good he is at those games. Like for how much better I am at Spyro 1, like that does not even come close to like offsetting how much, how good he is at Spyro 2 and 3. He's like, make no mistake, Hypnoshark is genuinely like a really good Spyro speedrunner. Just in general. Even, just generally speaking, even more so than me. If we're just talking like a general.
than Sprash Factor. Yeah, I mean, he's he's a solid and he's a good like to to dream of uh, racing Hypno in like any Spyro game besides Spyro One in my case is that's a that's like a that's a dream right now. That's not like a legit like thing I could accomplish anytime soon. For it to be a competitive race, I mean. Uh, maybe we'll get there. I stick with this game. Do talk to him. Turn around. Go this way. Nice. Well, I should have like shot that thing. Okay. Oh, hey, 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 none of that. Oh wait, what? I didn't activate the. Where's the guy? Huh? I thought I talked to Handle. Am I tripping balls? Maybe I like said no to him or something? My sister's what? Am I, yo, am I stoned? What, what's going on here? He's supposed to activate the boss baby. There he is. What the fuck? That baby was stoned. Yeah, I was feeling clean as hell there for a sec till Boss Baby decided to troll. Oh, no, fuck! I literally was like hoping that wouldn't happen. Jesus Christ. Whatever, try again. Luckily, it's like right here. Oh! Dumb shit. Over here. Nice, and I got all those. Dude, that was clean. This movement's getting decent. My movement's starting to get like resembling that of a speed run at this point. Uh, now we can go, not this way. Which way do I go? Yeah, this way. Right? Yeah, this way. Remember. It's kind of hard to remember with the routing here because you go through that like, you know, you talk to handle three times there. Oh, I have to. That's not gonna hit him. I'll just shoot him from afar here in a sec. Or I could shoot him now would be a good idea. I missed the initial thing. Let's get, get up here. The monkeys are. Is that a failure? Oh, okay. I was like genuinely curious. Camera is so awkward here. It's fucking annoying. Thanks for your help. Yeah, thank you, Dragon Bird. Why am I pot? Oh, it's because I was trying to mash through the uh, orb cuts. No, he's gonna get me. Oh, come on, just get through. You can do it. How do you get up there? What the fuck? All right, there we go. I guess I gotta go back towards that way, and then you gotta go up this thing as well. <laughs> All so that you could just skip pressing the button. By the way, like, come on. All right, there we go. Okay, and then you don't go that way. We just follow him here. Watch 
Watch out. Oh, come on. Don't hit me. Oh my Jesus. Oh! How did he even get me from that far away? I thought I didn't even realize he was still like even able to hit me at that point. Hey, you gotta go up that way. All right, nice. Hey, good movement there. I'll take that. You can go slow. You can go slightly in front of him. Yeah, I gotta angle the trajectory. Okay. Now get the boxes. Oh fuck! Well, that's fine. That bitch. You're so cool. One of these gems on my way back. Oh, that's not the right way to do that. Nice. Good shot. Nice shot. I'm glad there's a sound cue for when you actually get the shot there. Fine. Fall back. Causing issues. Okay. Oh, and you gotta go all the way around this time. Don't hit me. Oh god. Be careful, boss baby. Don't hit me. Oh, damn! Dude, it's like he's got the barrage, dude. The fucking barrage on that shot. I, I honestly stood no chance there. Ideally, you're ahead of him there. At least from what I see in the speedrun. Ooh, almost got over at that time. That's fine. No big deal. Oh my god, please. We gotta get it. I'm staying ahead of him. Dude. Quickly. Oh my god, please. Catching up. You might get me here. Okay, nice. Just finish it off. Okay, nice. Treetops, thank you for the sub, man. Love you. Great to see you. Keeping my spirits high during this run. We're on the back half here. We're doing good. And that should be everything in this level. Right, scorch complete. So yeah, definitely a few fails on the on the boss baby section for sure, but... Oh, is that 800 right there? 800 natural subs? I, I don't think so. Uh, exclamation point subs in the chat to see how many subs I'm at. Have to restart my uh, career at Dale Man Industries. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. Yeah, 784, so... And once again, I've kind of issued a little challenge to you guys. Um... It says 800. That's the sub points. So yeah, so sub points, I'm at 800. That's including like tier threes as well as my own sub. Um, but it's, it's 784 active subs. So for the rest of this run, since there is still left, you know, time in this run. Um, if you guys want to see me do Spyro 3 117, I'm just, this is just a little challenge I'm going to issue. You know, you guys totally don't have to. And I will play, by the way, for the record, I will play Spyro 3 117% anyways. Just, um, but if we get up to 800 by the end of this run, uh, or even by the end of the stream today, then I will do Spyro 3 117% tomorrow, and that's a promise. So if you want to see me do, and by the way, I've never speed ran that game before, so it's going to be a fully casual one sitting playthrough, which is probably going to be around the order of 15 or 16 hours. It is by far and away the longest Spyro game. So it'll be a huge, huge challenge. 
Uh, I'm trying to remember like the way to go here. Yeah, this way. So if you guys want to see that, feel free to gift a sub. Yikes? Yikes what? Something wrong? Wait, I have to go the other way. Make it. No, I... <laughs> Damn it. That sounds hard and not very fun. Well, you can, like, not watch is my recommendation to you. I don't, like, stream because it's easy, if that's, like, what you're implying here. I stream because it's like, I like I like challenges like that, even when it's not fun and whatnot, you know? So, sorry if you don't understand that, it's cool. I hope you do understand that, though. This might seem like kind of crazy, but you, guys, you just gotta understand that video games are just more than just like a fun, relaxing thing for me nowadays. So, I embrace challenges like that, where the normal person probably wouldn't. I get it. I get it, because you're right, it is like not fun in a long run. But I think the challenge is still cool regardless. You care for me? Well, I mean, like... My, here's, here's, I'm gonna ask this, and I don't, I hope you don't take this the wrong way. Just don't, you know? Don't, like, care for me like that. Like, I, I don't want that from you, Shiny. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's cool? Okay, cool. As long as we're cool, then that's all I care about. Don't give, don't give me any, like, you know, any... Anything like, Dario, I'm concerned for your health. I, I, I assure you, I care about my health and I will be okay. I gotta go this way. Fuck, dude, that's not good. Oh, I didn't mean to charge it. Just... Uh, Trita... Michaels. Nice to see you too, man. Hope you're doing well. Anyways, enough of me uh, worrying about you guys. Uh, I'm gonna worry about this run. Hopefully I can catch some of these gems in time. I'm probably not gonna catch them before the end of this like little cutscene thing here. Yeah, that was that was pretty slow. I should have cl cleaned up a lot more gems there. I need to make sure I go faster at that Damn. beginning part. You're concerned I'm not getting enough bitches? I know, I know. It's like, we have this parasocial thing going on and I know you really care about my health and stuff, but as I assure as you, you I get enough bitches. I have one. Her name's Sarah, she's very cute. I'm more her bitch, actually. Mutual bitches. We make Yeah, it'll be a chugger. I'll definitely be chugging at some point during it. Yeah, health-wise, I think the best move is for me not to drink too much during uh, long marathons like that. That was, that's what really helped me, um... Wait, did I talk to him again? I did, right? I think so. I got the... Yeah, I got the orb. Uh, where do I go? I gotta go clean up those gems and then continue on to the next area. Ordinarily, I would have cleaned all this up before the end of that, uh... Shepherd dude cutscene. Am I skipping money bags? The only money bags um, thing I buy in this entire run is swim at the very beginning. And then the rest of it, I skip to the end of the game at the start to get all the power-ups. A little, There's a little bit more to it than that, but that's like the short, in layman's terms. Short and sweet of it. And there are also versions of, um, of this run where you don't even get swim at all, so yeah. You can definitely play through this entire game without talking to money bags once. Oh, hi. Will I post this on YouTube? Yes, I will post this on YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Hey, if you're watching this on YouTube and you made it this far, post a letter Q in the comments so I know you're a real homie. 
Um, okay, so I am missing a purple gem somewhere, I would seem. Let's see where that is. Oh, I think, uh, maybe that room. That room that I didn't clean up yet. Where the fuck is Sparks telling me to go here? Where the fuck my Uber taking me, y'all? Where the fuck? Hello? Sparks, where are you pointing? I don't understand. Yeah, I think, yeah, that room right there, yep. Again, this room I would have cleaned up if I was quicker. It makes sense that I missed it. There we go. We are out. Q and no, that had nothing, no reference to Q anon. I just like the letter Q. I think it's a cool, cool letter. Michaels, thank you for the gift. Love you. And drop dead decadent. Oh, amazing name. And uh, thanks for watching. Keep it moving, dude. No. Hello, Spider. Yeah, you should like jump over him and then jump on the thing. Noted. It's coming up. Hello? What the fuck? How did I know you're there? Dude, what the shit? God damn, dude. I cannot fucking... Catching up. There we go. Some lucky RNG there. There we go. Okay. Shiny, thank you for the sub. Love you. Congrats on the learning. Love you, man. I appreciate that. Chug is in the chat. Getting us ever closer to the sub goal. We're at 786 right now. Absolutely sicko. What the fuck, Hunter? Can you relax? Where is he? Damn it, Hunter! You fuck! Where's he going? No. Hunter. Dude, he's going really fucking insane right now. He's just fucking farming them! Are you joking? He's so fucking good! I gotta like start like stealing them from him and shit. Shit! Give me this one. No! Is this the first time I fail popcorn? No. Okay, he needs one more and then he wins. Fuck! You're pretty fat. That you know what? Hunter went absolutely insane there. Hunter went Hunter was just fucking crazy, just farming them like crazy. So, I can't really be too mad about that, but dude, that was fucking insane on Hunter's part there. See, now I'm doing a lot better here. Fuck off. 
Fuck off. Fuck off! What? Where's he going? Oh my god, he's catching up, dude. Hunter guy is fucking crazy. Nope. Need one more, dude. Good lord, that was insane. Dude, he fucking, dude, Hunter went so fucking hard on the, the first time around. That was like fucking nuts. I think part of the problem was I wasn't playing good defense first time around. So Hunter got an early lead and he just kind of ran away with it. Not only was was the RNG good for him, but I was playing bad defense. So those two things together were just like a fucking slaughter on his part. Oh, this way. So GG's to Hunter there. Wait, hold on, am I doing that right? Yeah, I have to grab that. I have to grab these, or actually you don't even grab those yet. I think you grab this first, fuck. Blow that shit up first. And then you go this way, yeah. Then go. See if I can remember this. I gotta blow that up. Oh, and then down here. Oh, and I gotta. Oh, God. Blow that guy up. I already fucked him up. Dude, hello. Oh my god, I'm like... I'm like a child over here. Okay, now we go up. Hello, go up. Before I run out. Go up. Okay. I gotta go deep. For fundies, I'm gonna try some like this. No, I'm not gonna make it up there in time. You have to be like already like kind of close to that spot in order to. You want to trigger the two cutscenes at the same time: this orb scene and the talisman cutscene thing. Do I have all the gems. Uh, I am missing some gems here. This is concerning. Oh well, there's some at the end. So let's we'll see if. Yeah, yeah, 385. That's pretty. We're good. We're Gucci. Which Spyro game has the best soundtrack? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I think it is faster to go through the um, to go through the fucking uh, portal when you're next to one. When a level ends next to one, like right there, I think it's faster to go through the portal than to pause. World record in this game is a 132, I believe, by Blunt Bows. Interestingly, he does a route of the game that uh, ends not on the final boss. Just want to throw that out there. I'm not saying that's like a bad thing or anything, I'm just saying. He does a very different route of the game. Gecko, nice cock. The ending cinematic of the guy getting destroyed by the falling rock. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's so sad. Yo, cutie, wow. Thank you for the sub. Hey, thanks for being here. I think that sub is going to give me lots of luck for this uh, next section, so thank you. Love you, cutie. Blow that up. No, you didn't want to talk to him. That's fine. Oh, 
Come on, just grab it. I'm gonna grab this guy. I love the noise those fucking peacocks make. Wow. They sound like a real life, like, female voice. Like a real human. <laughs> it makes it, like, way more hilarious to me. I don't think peacocks sound like that. everyone in this room. We have a little low on enemies here. Nope, it's hard to avoid her. I miss all the... Okay, we got all the gems. Here. I think I have enough enemies now. How many do I do you need down there? I don't even know. Anyways. Spiral. It's gotta be like 15 or something, right? Did I do any practice runs offline? Um, I did a lot of route learning and practice mm. online. I haven't done anything offline, for starters, but I've done a lot of, of route learning online and several casual playthroughs online as well. Or at least a casual playthrough. I uh, gotta go back this way. So the short answer to your question is no, but the long answer to your question is I've done a lot of practice. Or at least a reasonable amount of practice. Where's the other guy? He's supposed to, he's, what? He's supposed to be over there? Supposed to be another guy like right here. I guess he tricked him into going down here. Must have triggered him a little early somehow. My eight brothers. Last guy right here. <laughs> I'm just gonna aim at him. Kill this last guy and then grab the last few guys. Now, yeah. Yeah, you're actually supposed to kill him before the uh, the mini game actually, because the mini game I think pauses the uh, pauses the lamp coming towards you. Should be the end of it. Come on. Yeah, dude, not, that was a clean, shady oasis. Not perfect, obviously, but I followed the route pretty accurately there, I'd say. Very nice. You sometimes do hippos as a backup orb. Oh, okay. 
All right. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. Was I supposed to like use this information for anything? I thought. Never mind. Good. All I can say is good for you. Thank you for sharing. And thanks for watching. Alright, we're going to the speedway. Let's do it. We're doing good. We're doing good. My math teacher used to say mnemonic to- Oh, shit. I gotta- oh, Let me just give up and turn- Actually, I don't need to give up. Let's just fucking turn it around. What's the big fucking deal, huh? I don't gotta give up. Why give up? Oh my god, hello? I might want to give up now. A little dangerous. Oh my god, parachute guys. Oh god, it's so hard to hit them. I missed him. Turn around. My eyes deceiving me. I'm do a whole nother lap here. I am missing a parachute guy somewhere. I see a parachute there. He's just flying. They just fly without you. That's interesting. When you did, when you take them off of their, uh, I didn't even know that. When you take them off of their little, uh, the little carts that pull them, they just fly in circles over there. Huh. That was a cool learning experience. Now I know. And I'm missing another one of these somewhere. Oh, it's that one. I always forget that one. Either. Or no. Huh. I'm not sure when you're supposed to grab that one. I guess when you're heading back through there. Weird. This is very, uh... Very sloppy, but whatever. Good job. What is no ER? No ER stands for no early Ripto. The modern 100% route of this game uh, actually does not finish the run on the final boss. It's funny you ask that right now. The modern 100% ru uh, route actually ends on this minigame. So I'm, a, I'm gonna take care to point out when the run ends exactly. And I just wanna just like, just point that. It's, it's just funny. It's just like, it's very anticlimactic. Oops, I fucked up. Hey, I heard you. Try it again, my bad. I'm very, I'm going quite slow on this icy here, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah, the, so the version of 100% I'm doing is no early Ripto, it ends on the final box. And there are some implications about that, uh, the main one being that I don't get the bonus from killing Ripto early, which is, um, an increased gem grab range. So that's like the main reason why they do that, is so you get like a better gem range and it makes the run overall faster. It also technically makes the route uh, a bit, I think, a bit more sensible as well, Just from a speed perspective. But yeah, a normal 100% run would, ra imagine you're on world record pace and you fit it, this is the end of the run and time. That would be time right there. Isn't that fucking insane? And that's it, <laughs> that's the whole run. <laughs> So it's a very funny, like, anticlimactic spot to end. It is interesting, though. How do you get Fireball early? You, um, you go into Dragon Shores. Um, and since the portal isn't open normally, if you get to Winter Tundra... Like, normally the- so say you, like, you know, do Gulp Skip and you get all the way through all that shit. 
Here, let me, uh... Am I missing any gems? I am missing some gems here. I think I'm supposed to... Yeah, this is kind of odd. I'm gonna try to recover whatever gems I'm missing here. I think, you know what? I think I know what it is. Hold on, let me go up here. I think they're up here, actually, to be honest with you. They're over... Yep, they're these. I knew I forgot about these. I'm supposed to grab those. Oh, there's there's more. I'm missing more gems here. Uh, where are they? They're down that way. Hold on, are they down like? Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Let me go back to that spot I was just at. I'm like kind of confused right now. I am missing gems right now. I got all the gems that were here. Okay. So I'm gonna actually head back up that way. I just was. I know it's kind of counterintuitive. Yeah, I'm missing a seven gem. <laughs> exactly. Okay, now let's try to like... Uh oh, I'm gonna fucking die here, I think. Cool. Cool. Nice, nice uh, recovery. Let's go up the whirlwind here. I take a lay of the land. If they're probably, I'm guessing it's some gems, um, like up against the wall, like the castle wall over here. But Sparks is telling me they're actually up in here, weirdly enough. Like they're up inside the castle, so I'm gonna go like in here. I'll I'll pay oh, the professor. Is it eight orbs or whatever? Yeah. Okay. So there's these. What else? And then there's more back here. Okay. God, I missed a lot of gems in this home world. Where is it? Yeah, over here. Gotta be like a five hiding somewhere. And where is it? There it is. I don't know how I missed that. That doesn't really surprise me, that particular one. Uh, and luckily, there happens to be another portal here to go to Winter Tundra, so that makes things a little easy. Don't have to go all the way back to the end of that area. A little sloppy. Oh, actually, that's not a real split right there. Yes, uh, in case you didn't know, Sparks does point to where the gems are if you hold all of the shoulder buttons. I didn't know that either. Uh, I think you grab these now. No, 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 you grab those later. Grab this now. Also, I have to pee, so hopefully we'll get through these last few levels with some some promptness. We're only at 247 right now. I mean, we're probably, I'm guessing we're going to be done around like three and a half hours, which is ideal. That's like kind of what I'm shooting for. We'll see. All right, time for uh, time for the fucking pencil thing. Pencil game. Oh. That is not in Spiral One, the gem finder thing. That's in this game, not Spiral One. Uh, go this way. Uh, go over here. Stewart, thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. Love you, Stewie. Yeah, I gotta go quick here. Uh, wait, was I supposed to talk to that guy? I think I was. Fuck, I fucked up terribly. Hold on, I need to go eat the egg now at this point. Yeah, grab it. Uh-oh. Uh, am I dead? Uh-oh, I'm fucking dead. I should have double jumped out the water. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking there. Now I gotta go get the egg again. Cool. Oh, okay. Well, luckily. I'm right here. <laughs> cool egg emo. Let me see who that is. Just out of curiosity. I know. I'm gonna waste time on my speedrun just to see that. Oh, it's your egg. Cool. You speedrun this, Fleetle? I didn't know that. I'm, I'm only assuming. I didn't even know you streamed. I should be following you. If that's the case. Why did I miss the screen? 
I'm sorry. By the way, I'm sorry if that was like an insulting question or anything. Like, of course I speed run this. I'm number five or so. Like, I'm sorry if I didn't know that. I have the feeling something like that is probably the case. Okay, right there, and then talk to this guy quickly. Oh, okay. No, all right. Did I hit both of them? Yeah, I did. Oop. Okay, talk to this guy. I might- the egg might run out of its timer. Oh. Let's see if I can get there quick enough. Oop, wrong way. This way. Come on, egg. Where you at? Yeah, the egg ran out of its timer. Eh, that's a- that's a- that's a, um, tight timing. To get that fucking egg. I should probably try, like, an easier variant of that strat for now. Like, not spit out the egg right there. That's that's very ballsy of me to go for that. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Hello? Where's the fucking egg? My, do I need... Here's another yeah, it stands for Elden Ring. Stuart, thanks for thanks again for the raid and for the uh, good luck. Hope you had some okay runs today. Doo -doo. Doo -doo. Doo -doo. Dude, really? You're kidding. And I have like a uh, sparks. Jesus Christ. Okay, now we got the egg. I am gonna real quick. Hey, fuck off. I'm gonna spit it out over there. Is that gonna make it okay? So I can shoot this guy. On the right. Have to go, yeah, go this way. I might have missed like a gem or two over here somewhere. Did I? Yeah, you come out of that later, so yeah, I think I'm good. Right? I, I remember like missing a gem around here before, but I think I'm, I think I'm good. Um, I, okay, now I'm trying to remember routing stuff here. I might have forgotten the route. Let me just think for a second. Gotta go... I think here. And then, oh yeah, and then you go up on top of the fucking place. Go up here. Yeah, now I remember. God, these guys are going to ham. Oh, I fucking went the wrong way also. I was supposed to do this. No big, I'm just sparksless during a section that I have to completely restart if I die. No big deal. I think I grabbed all the gems here. Up on the top part there. This routing is super bored. Oh, and I'm supposed to throw the duck in the thing also. That should work. Did that not work? Ah, there we go. Okay, so I gotta be extra careful here not to uh, die. And there's a bunch of enemies down here, so uh, I might like go out of my way for a sparks real quick. out, flame this bitch. Do that again. Oh, you can't 
can skip this. Just let it do its thing. And then I believe we go... What even do I have in my mouth right now? The radish? I don't even remember where to take this shit. Um... Okay, I'm, I'm a little lost right now. I think I go... Where does the radish go? It doesn't go in the water. In the cave? Okay, yeah, we gotta go to the cave. I'm trying to remember what the route is to go to the cave. I think you have to go back up this way. I'm not mistaken. Or no, yeah, you come back around this way, I think. Yeah, yeah, you go back around this way. Maybe this is correct. Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe you just climb up here right away. I'm gonna have to review this level later. Okay, and then we go... Whoops. Okay, we're good. We go over this way. Oh, no, no, hold on. We go up over here. Oh, we were... I know what we are supposed to have. We were supposed to teleport back to the guy after killing the kangaroo. Which, that didn't happen. Apparently, I missed one of the kangaroos somewhere. That's odd. Because, right, he's supposed to be like, wahoo. This is useful. Yeah, I only have three right now. Oh, I remember why. It's because the fucking the, the other kangaroo's over at the cave. I always forget about that guy. See, that's I knew that's what I was forgetting over here was to shoot the fucking this guy. Okay, so let me spit this out. Shoot that guy, and then eat it, and then wahoo, and then we can continue. That's why I was confused. Come on, eat it! No! Uh, no! Why? I gotta like run back there. I gotta run back there. If that shit runs out, I'm fucked. Quickly. Come on. Give me that. Okay, phew. Yeah, that was scary. All right, I'm remembering. I am actually remembering the route here, so that's good. It's no wonder I was like surprised there. I always, and that's not the first time I missed that kangaroo jack either. Right here once again, I believe. Right, yeah, this way. Go over here. Really? Come on, bro. What? Am I doing this wrong? Does it not go here? Oh yeah, it does. It just fucking sucks. <laughs> I was like convinced that I was like the wrong spot for it. Okay, grab me all these. Definitely don't forget about those reds. I could see myself forgetting those reds in the future. And then now you would go down this way. And then throw the coin in the damn thing. Can you like avoid the fucking elephant, may I ask, like when you can't fireball? Uh, I gotta go this way. Okay, now you spit this here, and then you grab these two. My pencil. Now, I should have all the gems, but so I have a... I have a feeling that I don't have all the gems. I am missing a lot of gems, actually. So let's find out where those are. Oh yeah, this whole area. Yeah, what's going on with this area? How did I forget this? Yeah, I will have to review the route there later. I think, yeah, yeah, that's what I was forgetting. I think it's, you do that after the, okay, I think I'm remembering this now. Let's get out of here. Continue this speed run. I'm, I'm starting to get into like a practice mode here when I should not. But yeah, I think you do that area. You shoot the kangaroo jack lady. So after doing the egg, you put the egg in the nest, you shoot kangaroo jack, you go down there, you get the gems, you pop out. And then you continue. Something along those lines. Might be slightly out of order, but it was, it's something like that. Yeah, there's a lot for me to remember there. I definitely need to review Mystic Marsh for sure. Uh, 
I always do that. In spiral one. Well, it's some kind. My pencil. Fireball does not work for the big rocks, no. You'd think it would, but it does not. I'm sure I got everything here. Camera. The fuck are you gonna use that now? Okay. I wanna talk to the guy. I'm not making that. I need to do a walking DJ there. No, I probably don't need to, but I will. Or maybe not? Yeah, no. Walking DJ is the move there. Ugh, come on. Can I just do it off the first stair, though? Yeah, that worked. Oh, what? Hey, don't talk to the guy. You have to like specifically not talk to the guy here. Oh my goodness, come on. You can do this, bro. This is definitely not like an easy jump or anything, but it's just an annoying. <laughs> come on, camera. Oh, come on. You fucking joking? Dude, are you serious? Fucking jump. Come on, that- Why does that not work? Good lord! Oh god. With the no camera, by the way. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna shoot both of these. Or I'm gonna shoot one of those. Shoot the other one once I clear out the room here. That miss? Okay. I suppose you Oh my god, that was a uh, fucking That was an Odyssey right there. Yeah, the, the bell noise is dope. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Oh. Can't like hit that out the air, can you? I think you're supposed to just flame this and then do that. Oh my god. There you go, some shit like that. And it teleports you up here. Now this is the part where I gotta be kind of slick. That's all I needed there, right? Yeah. This is the part where I gotta be kind of slick because you kill these guys. And then... Do all this, but get this guy. Head down here, get all these gems. Oop, except for that one. And then, yeah, I didn't quite do it in time. You want to get all those gems and talk to the fucking uh, orange hair guy in order to get him to start the mini game early. But that's okay. I was not, I was not expecting to get that. 
Hopefully I didn't miss any gem back there. Can you hit this? Yeah. I'm a secret agent. I'm a secret agent. Oh, I turned him. We're good. Oh! Damn it. Try that again. I'm not. At least that happened early and not late. If I, as long as I don't fucking fail this shit late, I'm good. He almost saw me there. He could kind of see you like around the corner slightly. One of these days I will get all those gems before entering this area, but we're fine. Should be everything? Of course not. Uh, 395. I have a feeling the last one is in that little hut over there. Let's see what Spark says. And it's over there somewhere. Yeah, you think it's to the left actually. Can you double jump up there? Maybe? I don't know. I think it's in this room somewhere. Anytime now. What? Where? Here? Oh, it's one of these boxes. I guess I must have missed it. Right. That's fine. Whatever. That was just a a flub. I did I did go for that gem. I, I charged through that part as part of the route, so it's not like I forgot it. It was probably one of those things where I stopped to, to double jump and I thought I collected it when I didn't. I like let go of square too quick, probably when I hit it. Okay, let's roll. Now, you know what? All things considered, that was not like awful. I'll take that. We're out of there decently fast enough. For how long I could be stuck in there, I think I'm doing. I think I'm doing good. The fucking um. The shadows from like the the gem numbers when you collect a gem, it like gives you the number. The shadows from that make me think that they're the shadows from the gems, like about to drop out of the fountain. You know, it's confusing to me. I can. Okay, last full level of the run. Where are we at? 3:08. Yeah, we're definitely standing to maybe finish this run around 3:30. I'm hoping if I have a quick, quick metropolis here. I, I definitely would like to shoot for sub three on my next run after some practice. I think that's what I'm thinking. But I will practice Mystic Marsh a bit. Maybe even practice some of that other, other levels. Why did I not talk to that guy by accident? Oh, you're supposed to knock that down. This is another crazy jump here. I can get this. You have to be holding cardinal up when you go for this. I'm gonna just like do this. Yeah, yeah perfect. Best boss fight in the game here. Standard first run time, I don't know. Whatever you're seeing now, that's the standard that's first run time. <laughs> I haven't really asked them in the Discord, like, how fast were you guys' first run, though I would reckon they're somewhere around this area, three to four hours. I'm 
or some cool people would say sub sub three. Cool guys. Don't want to activate that early. I do not want to do that. Anytime. All right. Oh fuck, where am I looking? Uh, this way. Like some blue gems you're supposed to grab here? I guess not. Maybe, maybe that's later. Oh, those up. Actually, you can grab those later, I think, as well. That you're supposed to do this, and then blow that up on the way up, and go over here, and then the cycles would be consistent. And then you don't talk to this lady yet, but whatever, doesn't matter. I remember some of the first times I did in Spiral 1. Uh, yeah, the first times I did with a route uh, were probably in like the two and a half hour range. Maybe high two hour range. But that's like kind of similar with this game. This, Considering that this game is slightly longer than Spiral 1, then um, it makes sense that my first run's around three hours. I mean, look, I'm not trying to like, guys, like this whole conversation is like a real like, oh, like, what's, what should your first time be? And it really, like, I don't like that. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm like, I just suck, you know? So I'm not trying to, like, sit here and, and like, think about, oh, am I sucking good enough yet? It's like, you know what I mean? That, that's, like, where that conversation goes mentally for me, and I don't like that. Is my sucking justified? I'm not sucking worse than the next guy, right? It's like, fuck off, who cares? Like, you know what I'm saying? Or like, oh, it's okay if I suck as long as I suck better than someone else when they're starting out. It's like, that's just so stupid. It's a very plaguing way to think about stuff. Show yourself. Oh, there he is. Nice flying, Airman. You've proven the genius of. When will I do glitchless spiral run? You suck great. I hope th I hope that message is a joke. Um, I forgot how to clean this part up, but I think I just go down here, right? I fucked up at the end of the last run was uh let's go up this way. I'm running out of uh, this. Let me just do this real quick. Nice, not bad. Get me out of there. to the end, y'all. We finished the last, like, major level just now. 
so hopefully we're about cleaned up with stuff. I am missing, it looks like, seven gems here in the homeworld. So let's see where those are. Oh, they're they're in the this door. I always forget there's gems behind right. this door. Oh, that's seven, two, four, yeah. Nice! Sweet! Amazing, just have Ripto and then we're done. What are we looking at? 350? Yeah, this is gonna be like a, maybe 320 or something? Hopefully this fight doesn't take too long. It shouldn't take that long. Let's fucking go. Let's go, not bad. Definitely, I was shooting for sub four. You know, somewhat hopefully getting towards three. And that's what this was. I, I definitely had like, you know, I've probably fucked around for at least like half an hour on stuff in this run. Just like being stuck or whatever, or like, you know, just not first trying, whatever. But though I will say my, um, my, my gulp was pretty good. Or my gulp skip. It was second try. I mean, you know, there's in, there's time to save everywhere. Thank God. Though I could definitely see like on my next run or two, possibly, uh, possibly losing time on the boss rush, but whatever. I don't think I'll start resetting yet over having a bad, uh, having a bad, uh, oh, I spent a lot of time on the Dragon Shores thing. I think that's where the, the majority of my time loss was, was from on that section. So I like three or four times a good thing. Aim at him correctly. I gotta remember to like charge in midair to turn around. I still do the thing where I press triangle like a dumb fuck. Nice, GG, time. 316, nice. My first ever Spyro 2 speedrun, done. First real speedrun. I followed a pretty legit route. Nice old school fucking speedrunning boomer ass route of this game. And that is a fucking GG for me. I hit the time that I was kind of imagining. Um, sub four, it's decently sub four. Um, I fucked around a lot in a lot of levels, especially Mystic Marsh. Um, Amongst other places, Aquaria, I fucked around a bit. Um, I don't think we can ever thank you enough. What is it like? Yeah, there's a lot of uh, pretty much every level has a bunch of time to save in it, which is good. Um, but it's not like so bad that it's just like a joke. Um, it feels like this is like a good starting point that I could go from, start kind of grinding out runs. Um, yeah, I really, I really feel like I'm at a point where I can start kind of just doing runs and start like just improving and just getting more, start start to hone things a little, just a little bit. Of course, while still watching, you know, referring back to 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 Alley Dest, I am gonna do some practice, especially on a uh, Mystic Marsh, um, amongst other levels. I need, I do need to practice um, my boss rush uh, for sure. But you know, it all, all things considered, for you know, really kind of. Going at it for two days straight, learning the route, um, and then taking a break for a day to do the fucking 1200% and now being here, finally doing the run after a day of review. Um, I really feel like I've put in a lot of really nice work over the, this last week in this game, and it's nice to have it pay off in a run that's like something like a real speed run. I mean, it's, you know, it's not fast. My next run, I'm going to be aiming for sub three, but, you know, if you were joining, if you joined me for this first um, kind of foray into the game, um, I thank you for being here. I gotta say, this is a pretty fun game. I know, I know, I know. You wouldn't expect me to say some crazy shit like that, but I, I am starting to enjoy this game as a speed run. I've gotten past all like the shittiest parts of like learning and just hating yourself. Uh, there's gonna be plenty more self-loathing to come for sure, but um, you know, I, I finally feel like I have a foundation set as a as a 100 speedrunner in this game you know it's not a it's obviously a very shaky you know foundation made out of tape and bubble gum and fucking rotting wood but as time goes on we'll we'll sharpen and chisel away at it until it's a beautiful marble sculpture of a of a nicely honed run look at like squidward like right now it's like the spongebob thing where squidward like makes the shitty fucking sculpture and then spongebob uh, as i keep going it'll turn more into like the spongebob like dink and it's like perfect yeah. I call this one Elephant in Motion. <laughs> More like belongs in the ocean, or whatever he says. 
Bold and brash. Right now we're at bold and brash. Belongs in the trash. But we're getting to that SpongeBob level of artistry, artisticness. So yeah, guys, thank you once again for joining me for this. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, please drop a sub. Please check out my clips channel. I have always have everything linked down below in the description. And uh, stay tuned for more Spyro 2. If you like this type of con uh, content, just let me know in the comments. I am plan on doing more Spyro 2. That's like my tentative plan. Though I have not given up on Spyro 1. Don't worry. I still want to get the 120 and 120. But in any case, we'll see where uh, destiny takes us. And until then, I hope you have an excellent day. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.